What's up, y'all? Is it 12 o'clock? Is it 12 o'clock, y'all? Hey, good morning. Good morning. I'm feeling pretty good today. Wait a minute. What's going on, y'all? What's going on? Y'all thought I was going to be late today, huh? I know it's 12 o'clock. Listen, so I'm going to go on and pray, but we're going to be messy today, okay? We here for the mess today. We got T.S. Madison coming in today on the live, and I'm not responsible for what might happen today because I heard these people on been on live talking about us and stuff like that. I totally felt the, you know what? Let's pray. Heavenly Father. We thank you for everything you've done, Lord Jesus, and we thank you for everything you're going to do, Lord Jesus. We already know you're in control, God. We know that you're going to keep us healthy, Lord. You're going to stop the deaths, Lord. You're going to control this virus, Lord. You're going to take care of it for us, Lord Jesus. We know your steps are ordered. Lord, we just pray for our families, our children, everybody in the hospitals and our first line of defense that they stay safe, Lord Jesus. We thank them, Lord Jesus. Bless them all in a special way, Lord. Bless our finances, Lord. Keep your heavenly angels all around our children and our families, Lord Jesus, and keep us healthy, happy, and content in every way possible. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay. Now, I done heard some mess that happened, and I don't even want to talk about it. I don't even want to do it because these messy people done went online. Now, I said I was going to leave Simone ass alone, didn't I? I said she had said some shit to me. Y'all said y'all had brought it up. And I said, listen, let's save the reads for the cameras. But the bitch done came again. And that's how they do me, right? They keep coming and coming. And then when I say some shit, I'm wrong. That's how they do me now. I've been positive all these 37 days. Y'all know I have. Now I had to, girl, what happened? Yep, they was talking, wasn't that Chris? I saw, I didn't see it because the bitch blocked me. I couldn't see it, but you, you know what I'm saying? Y'all bold enough to be saying shit. Why you gonna block me for? You blocked me, but I still heard about it. I had to get my red cup. I had stopped the red cup. I was doing better, but y'all done took me, y'all done took me back. Let's talk about it. T.S. Madison, where you at, Gail? Let me put my stream yard up here, y'all, because I want to hear what y'all got to say. Cause I'm trying to be good to people. I ain't did nothing to nobody. I've been around here trying to, trying to, trying to be nice and inform the people about the damn thing and tell them how to get their damn money and all of that. And the people, the people. <laughs> girl, what you here about? What you want to hear about, girl? Here about, girl. About, girl. girl, I'm upset. Is they recording? Is this shit on? It is this the honey. What is you talking about, Dr. Hamlin? Boy, what you people that made me mad. I'm trying to get the code back right. Wait a minute. Let me get the code. Let me get it so we can get the people in. Okay. Child, because that's how we're going to have to do today. Because I, I told them folk to leave me alone. I ain't bother nobody. Who cussed you out this morning? I said nothing to nobody. I done woke up to some bullshit, T.S. Madison. Well, who cussed you out? Yeah, the people on Married to Madison. I thought we were supposed to be... Honestly, I thought we were supposed to be promoting the L.A. show, but they bringing all kind of shit back to Atlanta and what I done did and all that. I, th I already got that check. That check been cash. We gonna bring this shit back up. <laughs> now, I'm about to get messy. They done brought out my red cup, T.S. Madison, but I ain't girl, gonna... Y'all go ahead and listen to you go, Girl, you gonna, have them, you gonna have them girls trying to slice my throat every time now. Girl, I'm just a spectator. All I'm doing is looking. I'm just a spectator. They say the people, they say the people trying to come for me. What the hell? I done, I done got that chick. I thought I had already done that work. Now I got to go back and read these bitches some more. Well, come on. Let me see what you got. Let me see what you got, Dr. Hebley. Let me see what you got. Oh, I'm just trying to make it. I've been trying to be positive for the folk. We've been talking about saving lives and the corona thing, T.S. Madison, and we've been telling the people how to get their stimulus checks. You know what I'm saying? We've so, been over there praying for the people and helping them. So now they want to fight. They want to box you in the closet now. They want to lock me up in the closet. Now, I've been nice. And the people had been talking about me before, right? But I, uh -huh. said, I said to myself, I said, self, I don't want to be alone. I ain't going to talk about it. But they keep coming. So, T.S., should I talk about them? You tell me if I should just leave it alone. If you tell me to leave it alone, I'm going to leave it alone. 
But if you say I should talk about it, T.S., I'm going to talk about it. We're going to put them on the docket, damn it. What they said. Okay, what's the context of what they said? I have to think. I got to see what the context well, I I don't know what the context the what they said. Because, listen, they had blocked me. So I couldn't see exactly what they had said, but I woke up this morning to a lot of texts and shit, and I don't like to get shit secondhand. So the people don't come in, they're going to tell me what they said, okay? Y'all want me to address it? Tell me if y'all want me to talk about it. Let's see what the people say. Come on. All right, Michelle, should I talk about it? Yes. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hi, boo. You're so pretty. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You guys are gorgeous. And I just, I'm I'm shocked. I am shocked because Dr. Heavenly, I may have missed some lives, but I remember you crying, well, trying to hold back your tears about the friendship, the loss of friendship, the misunderstanding that you may have experienced with Dr. Simone. You, you weren't talking negatively about her at all. At all. What did I'm she say? I'm not going to say some shit that really was on my heart to say. I'm about to say it, y'all. Well, what did well, she say, though? What did she yeah, say? What did she say? What did she say? Because I, oh, I was somebody on here that saw it. Did anybody on here see well, it? I didn't, I didn't see it, but before you get rid of me, I love you. You are amazing. T.S., you are amazing. I saw you on the RuPaul, in the car with RuPaul. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I just, you have, Dr. Heavenly, you have made the quarantine enjoyable. I'm a school teacher in Virginia. It's so I just, cool. you are oh, so thank you. Oh, thank you. Because yeah. you're seeing me through your beautiful eyes. That's yeah, why. You're so beautiful. That's like why. Like what I really wanted to get on here this morning and talk about was skin. I didn't know that doctor. <laughs> that she was, that she, I didn't know she wanted to peel somebody's skin back this morning. Oh, <laughs> oh. Thank you. Thank you so much. I love both okay, of you. Yeah, after we find out what we're okay. Okay. Right, okay, I'll come back. Bye bye. Yeah, what's going bye -bye. on? She's so pretty, Dr. She's so pretty. Isn't she beautiful? She's oh so my god. Yes, what you want to talk about? You want to get out what you want to talk about first? Because this uh, no, because I need to know what's going on. So I can I, I, I want to weigh in on it. Let's do okay, it. Let's weigh in on it. Hopefully, Lady B know what the hell happened. Lady B, did you see it? I did not see it. And I think you should just leave it alone. Just leave it alone. I mean, it's childish. No, oh, no, no. It's obvious that they're jealous. It's obvious that they're jealous. It's obvious they're jealous, but they keep talking. They want, they want me to say some shit, so I'm not going to leave them. Exactly. Before. Don't give them what they want. No, I Don't give them what they want. You're not going to be happy, Lady B. You know how you got children? You got any kids? Yeah, they yes, don't I do. You beat their asses. They act up, <laughs> act up to you with their asses, and then they be quiet. They be like, "Ooh, heavily was wrong." I don't be wrong. Y'all don't show the shit that I, they actually said to me. Toya bitch ass said my house was fifty thousand dollars. When she got the call that she got approved for her damn loan, when she didn't even yeah, approve because she was asking for the money. Don't Toya is a totally different kind of. Uh, Leave me alone. She, I've been trying to be nice. <laughs> And you are, and you are. Damn, Lonnie, we gonna talk about They need to catch up with you. They need to catch up with you. They need to catch up with you, really. And I just want to say that I love you, and I fellow boopies, I fellow boopies, love you. T. S. Madison, you are beautiful. I'm I love the trio. Now we need Funky Dineva to call in, so we have that trio. I'm I need to get Dineva on here. Okay, I'm yes, gonna right now. We need yes, to get God. Dineva on here. Come back if you need to, Boopy. Let me send him the link right now. Let's talk okay, to get Dineva the link because Dineva will come on here. You now. I can't see you now, Boop. So I can't talk to you if I can't see you, Boop. Come back in so I can see you. You want faces on here? Let's see what Dineva okay. is. I feel like if you ain't showing me your face, you're doing one of them the moves that uh let me send this link. <laughs> Girl. I was trying to be quiet. I said, I ain't want no more problems. Baby, Donnie will say, listen. He probably yes. saw it, too. I didn't see it, honestly. Oh, what's going on? on. Girl, I'm, thinking, I'm thinking that we finna talk about the, uh, the not getting no nails. I ain't having on no lotion. We all home. And she, everything, just chilling. Oh, Lord. 
flood. I don't see no Scotty, so we ain't gonna let him in. Chad, get y'all internet together. <laughs> Coca Cola, is that some? Wait a minute, Coca Cola probably saw that. Get y'all in the See how all the ladies look around with their pretty skin? They skin pretty. You got beautiful oh, Thank skin. you. Oh, pretty skin. You want to tell you got to pull the blades out, the knives, and you got to pull the razor blade from under your tongue this morning. Damn. <laughs> Damn. No, but, but I love both of y'all, Dr. Heaven. You know I love you, but um, I heard Simone, she said that she wasn't going to deal with nobody who's negative and stank. And something about a, a stank coochie. Oh, that and... was a coochie. She the one who a coochie stank. Let's be clear. Jackie gave her some shit to clear that shit up. She said it on national TV. Now, I can't shit out. Don't get on TV and say I put out some shit that you told me in confidence and use that lie again. Don't do that because I don't know nothing about no stank coochie. Now, that's the first time I heard that. But I'm hearing a whole bunch of shit that was said. And my whole thing is we supposed to be promoting the LO show. Yeah, yeah, girls, letting them do their shit. We ain't even filmed yet. We in quarantine. Why y'all bringing yeah. my name up, Jackie name up, Quad name up? Why y'all doing this? Yeah, and then they were talking about it's so much shit that they could say about people on the show, but they didn't want to go there. And I didn't know who they were talking Ooh, about. I promise to I Jesus, a lot of bitches been holding their tongues, so be very careful. I mean, and, and to me, you could say it because they all be lies. If you yeah, yeah. Truth, bring some receipts with the bitch, because I got receipts with my shit, and I don't be lying like the rest of them. And that's, and that's why they're so fucked up, because I speak the truth. I've been trying to leave people alone, Coca-Cola. Yeah, I don't know who they was talking about. They did not say a name. I'm not going to lie and say they said a name, but they said well, so much they shit they can say about the people. people on the show. Okay, so you saw it. You, did you see it or no? Yeah, I did look at part of it. I caught it while Toya was in the middle of talking to Sister. But I thought they were promoting the L.A. show. Yeah, but they were not really talking in context to the L.A. show. It was more about personal and what was going on with them. Mm, I don't know, girl. Well, we going to pray, okay? We're going to try to get somebody in and know what they, they saw it, okay? Okay. Come on back in, baby. I didn't see it. Who is the other lady? Hey, let's say before we start, <laughs> this is do 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 do. Come on, come on, TS. Don't do 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 do. Play the music. Don't do 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 do. TS Madison. Don't do 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 do. Not heavily. Now you know that I'm gonna be in the hot water. About the coochie, about talking about stinking coochie. I got to get out. The, I got to move out the fire from there. Hey man, no, listen, you know I can't get in that girl. They I try to have my head on the chopping block, like I said it. I don't know what see this. No, what did you say? Some stink. That what the girl had said. Who's uh, I got you know, hey, Simone's a hater. I hate to be so blunt about it. They haters. They well, haters. Is, what is what did I do to Toya but uplift her? What did I do mm -hmm. to after her husband attacked me over and over again on, on, on uh Twitter when I told her, get your man over and over again? I respond one time. They fucked up forever. Come on, man. Leave me alone. Where, where, where can you find the receipts? Is there receipts out there? A child, don't do that. Don't do I'm that. I'm trying to find the receipts. I'm I need the Googles. What is it? Say that. Simone, they say that. Y'all tell me the truth because I got it from a very reliable source that she said that I don't know. Oh, dear God. Father God, please. I don't see it. Mary Risto sent me money. People be sending me money. Us, <laughs> <laughs> what do they do? What do they do? Girl. It's on a page. I'm blocked from a page. Oh, my dear God. Uh, I don't know. Thing is, if you gonna mention my name, and Shantae Ra Rain say I saw the whole thing. So okay, well come on in and tell me about it, girl, because I don't know nothing. She said she saw the whole thing. It said it was Instagram live. Hey, sugar, how you doing? Hey, yeah, I don't know who that lady was that was just on there, but 
that uh, Toya did not say anything about uh, a funky vagina or even uh, Simone. Mm -hmm. So whoever that was, she didn't watch the live. I watched complete live. They went out, they came back on. They were promoting the L.A. show. They definitely were. Uh, it was a point where Toya even said that cast members got fired. Then uh, they, they, uh, Simone actually got off and Cecil got on his live because Simone said she wasn't going to entertain it. don't know anything about it. So they got back on, but instead of uh, Toya being on, her husband came on. And so they tried to divert the conversation, but the people wouldn't let it go. So it was, they were promoting a lot of L.A. show, but they also went on to the housewives. And they were trying to get Toya to say who she was saying that didn't get, you know, wasn't coming back on the show. But I can tell you that Simone didn't necessarily want to entertain talking about you, but Toya kept on. She said, I had she said that she said that I had um, corrupted Jay's mind. Did that not happen? She said she said that you muted her when you did the closet uh, thing and that you kind of sabotaged the closet uh you know, the competition with the closet, but that wasn't true. Yeah, something was wrong with her. Yeah, we know about her, but what did Simone say? Yeah. Did Simone say I corrupted Jackie's mind? Did she say that? Because that's what the people told me this morning. Well, you're going to hear a lot of stuff from people. No, All of it is not true. Did you see that? You didn't see that? No, not to that point. No. Simone, did Simone say every the positive? No. What she was just saying, she did say about negative energy, but it wasn't anything about, you're going to hear people say a lot of things. I heard every live that they had, and I seen a live with you and Toya doing the positive thing. So people, that lady that was on before, she didn't watch the show. She just wanted to look at your face. Because it, Simone kind of stepped back, especially when she was talking about people got fired. She didn't want to entertain it. She got off the live, and it was just Cecil and uh, Toya's husband, Eugene. So Toya was help you out. I can say that, and then they diverted back to uh, L.A. Uh, yeah, what you say? You 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 breaking up? What you say? I said Toya did dog you out. She talked about you pretty bad, and and she wouldn't kind of wouldn't yeah. let it go and kept talking about what but you why? did. But why? What did I do to her but uplift her and her man? What did I do to her? Okay, where okay, is you it so I can watch it? Is this somewhere where I can watch it, baby? Where the live at? Where, where the live at so I can watch it? Because I'm finna watch Why would I block and mute her? Come on now. I said she won the closet challenge. I was giving her. I did not block her. I did not mute her. Her shit wasn't good. I mean, maybe because her house knew or something. Her internet. I know. Somebody said. But that's why I was so shocked that she said that to everyone. Uh, you know, it was a totally different Toya talking yesterday. She was drinking while she was talking, so she may have been too, too loaded, but the way she acted the day when you did the live and we were watching it was totally different than what she told the people on Instagram yesterday. So it was completely different. I was shocked. I was like, okay, what personality is this talking? Because she didn't do that when you were doing the closet check. It was all fun and so forth. The what? I said it was fun when she was doing it, but yesterday on Instagram Live, it was totally different. Like you were against her, you were an enemy, and you stopped her from being heard by the people. Oh, it was just crazy. So it was a totally different personality yesterday in regards to talking about you and, and, and everything. I was shocked, and I thought you guys were a bit closer than that. You know how you always talk about you love her, and, you know, she, you just accept her for who she is and stuff like that. But, honey, yeah, you that you that. Because I told you I really like Toya. Without the cameras, me and Toya are cool. So I don't like the fakery. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. When you got eyes on you and you in a different people company, you being fake. We were cool, right? I, I want to watch the live. live. I, I want to see the live. live. Somebody I mean, see well, let's go back. Okay, so uh somebody can watch me the live. Um you 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 uh you uh her her live uh stopped, so let's go back. Somebody is me the line. I ain't seen it, so tell me there, but what's up? The, the hey. Hey, the, the live, the live is on uh well they got still got it up on Instagram on Dr. Um what her name is Simone page. Yeah, what her name is? Mm. Simone, Simone page. I just I just tried to click on it while y'all was on live. But right. Simone uh Simone had the live, I think by three uh lives on her on her page herself. So well, Toya was the, I didn't see it myself, but this the huh? live. I think I mean yeah. if that's the page, I ain't seen it. I, I mean, I don't know if that's the live. I, I don't know if that's the live with Toy on it, but 
that that's what's on Dr. Uh, Simone's page. That's it. Okay, all right. <laughs> they say Toya came on. Like, I know mean, I didn't see it. Let's be let me let me back up before I say some shit. But I, I didn't see it. I didn't see it. You 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 breaking I, up, Dr. Okay. okay. TS, what's your IG? Uh, the at the real TS Madison. I, I, I'm, I I'm, I'm, wanted, but my whole thing is Toya. Uh, this, this I'm one, not, yeah. Like that, I thought Simone said this. Simone, that's, said that's what I'm talking about. When we talk about, I think she's stupid. Okay, I think she's stupid. She's stupid. She's stupid. She's stupid. This the one right here. That's it. That's it. I don't know if that's the one exactly, but that's that's on Doctor Simone page. I don't know if that's the one with Toya. Let's let's. I don't know if that's the right one, but I think they were yeah. live more than once, like yesterday. But I heard they were talking big shit. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. That's it. They got to be it because that's Toya's. Yes. So Toya was talking big Toya shit. Wasn't even in the live, was she? Her ass Toya, was Toya, Toya, man. To right? This huh? Because I'm finna watch it, right? I'm finna put my earphones in and listen. For a check, that's what I think. That's the I one. Think, I yeah, I think that is. Yeah, I think it is. Oh, don't let me get. Okay. All right, Deborah. We're going to come back to you, okay, boo? All right, love you. I love you too, baby. Don't make me start nothing that ain't going on. Hey, Dr. Pink, how are you? Hey, Dr. Heavenly. Hey, Maddie, how are you? Good. Um, I just wanted to say, Dr. Heavenly, I haven't watched the live, but I think that um, I think that both of them um, are seeking some attention, and I would not give them anything. Let's give it to I would not give them anything, Dr. Heavenly, because when you had her on the show, you did not mute her. No, there was something going on with her audio. You were very respectful both times that you had her on the show, actually. And you even complimented her home once uh, the house tour ended. You know, you didn't say anything negative about her. Um, so for her to now uh jump on Simone's live and, and and basically I guess dog you out or whatever or throw shade your way. I think she's just seeking some attention. That's all it is. Okay, we're gonna be like I'm not worked out. Hey, I feel like this shit is funny, but my whole thing is people get mad when I speak and I speak the truth. Exactly. Exactly. Because they get the lion. They, they don't, don't give them a it, but don't. anyway. But Heavenly, Dr. Heavenly, don't give them nothing. Don't, don't give them nothing. Let them have it. People tell me that I ain't giving them nothing. Oh Let them have it. Let them have it. Uh, Miss Maddie, how you doing today, boo? You are snatched. I'm, I'm still I'm still watching it because I need to see what's going on before I give my opinion about it. Well, you are snatched, boo. You look good. You look good. I am doing very well. Oh, okay. You're watching it right now. I'm putting cream oh, in the cream. No. Okay, I'm going to come back. Who's, to who's the other person on there? Who's the second person besides Simone? I don't know. That who's girl? that, T.S.? Oh, that's her husband. I see. So, are you serious? Are you doing that again? It's him. I don't know why he dealt with them too. But I, I like Simone. I see, so, right? But Doctor Hamley, don't give them anything. Don't give them nothing. Oh, I'm give it. No, I'm gonna give it. Don't. To huh? You. You okay, tickle pink. Okay, baby. I'm not what the happened, girl? Well, let me mute you. That's all right. You can. You gonna let me watch it? You don't watch it. She kept ignoring me when I was writing in the comments, like, oh, you need to work it out with her. And Dr. Jackie, she kept ignoring it. But here's what happened. She didn't use the word corrupt. She somehow Dr. Jackie's new house um got brought up, the renovations. And so um Toya was like, Are we gonna go over to Jackie's house to see, you know, like when it's done? She was like, 
I don't know. Her and Dr. Heavenly are real close. And she said, oh, we're going to go over there when the cameras are there, when Bravo is there. But as far as, like, personal, no. She was just making it seem like, you know, y'all so close and that I guess Dr. Jackie really don't mess with her like that and stuff like that. And then the second thing was, she had a first interview with a girl from L.A., Shanice, I think, or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. And so I guess people be saying that y'all look like twins or something or that y'all look alike. They say my daughter looks like her. Yeah. Like, I think she she probably like 35, I think. Yeah. So um, somehow that got brought up the looks. And um, Dr. Simone was like, so when people tell you you look like Dr. Heavenly, how do you feel about that? And she was like, look like shady like this, like basically from a shade. I'm glad I don't look like Simone with them teeth. Come on now, let's not do this. Let's not do this. The over yonder bite. I know Dr. Heavenly. But the St. Cookie part, she wasn't talking about you. This lady commented and said she had six kids or something like that. And so she was trying to tell them to like tighten up with surgery and all that. She wasn't talking about you then. Okay, so she but, didn't say I corrupted Jackie's mind. She didn't say anything about her and Jackie not being close and they'll never be the same. And Jackie did something wrong to her. So I don't know. She said her and Quad have not been close. Somebody asked about Quad. She said her and Quad have not been close for years. She okay. didn't use the word corrupt, but she did say, oh, about like going to see Dr. Jackie's house. She I was like, oh. exactly what was said. Don't bring up my damn name. Let's bring it up, baby. But I kept telling her, like, look, y'all need to work it out. And I know it's, uh, they saw it because I was the one that posted it like 10 times. Okay, so Simone that, ain't said nothing negative about me or Jackie. She basically said, Dark, oh, she, the TS9, what? Okay, what you got? So Simone was asked, did you interview her? And she said, hell no. Nah. She said, I don't want to talk about no motherfucking heavenly. Oh, yeah. Ooh. She said she didn't want to talk about no heavenly. And oh, hold on. I'm getting Simone. Mute me. <laughs> this message go this message crazy as hell but anyway she bringing up evidence i think this shit is funny but i don't think it's I good know. to use your friends as a storyline for a check i'm not saying i'm even simone's friend i feel like jackie's her friend that's what mm -hmm. i think i think that jackie was her honest friend i do and jackie has never said anything negative about simone at all so for I, her, I, the yeah. they're not close and you know what I mean? And somebody said, y'all tell me if it's true. They said, well, I don't think you should promote stuff on, on, the, on the show. That's what we do. About the show. Uh, oh, shit, right? That's dumb. She, did, she also did say, oh, she didn't say no names, but we knew who she was talking about. Cause she was like, somebody be online every day or every other day talking shit. I, I, I. She did say that. I, I, I never say anything negative about her. In fact, I was saying that we I know hope that. we friendship better. I was trying to tell her that well, she well, got I, the I, I lies before she talked shit. Okay, how am I and, talking? And, but I will say this: everybody was drinking. She did say that she wasn't drunk. She said she was drinking vodka, and she still had some wine. So everybody was drinking. But um, she did say something to the extent of um, I just lost it. It lo it went over my head. But yeah, I would, Doctor Jackie. We we not listen. Let Doctor Simone talk about her, and I'm gonna have to pull up on her. Okay, she said a yellow the, a girl from LA got a man. No, who got it? Toya ass was that job? Oh, yeah, and ran her ass off her own damn show. That man, we don't want to talk about it. That's what I was going to say. They talk about shit, and then when I bring the truth, they be mad. <clears throat> so the question was asked. Dr. Simone asked Toya, like, who is your favorite LA member? I forgot the girl name because I don't really watch LA. But she said the girl who got in Dr. Heavenly ass and Cecil was in the background like, oh, she got in her ass? She got no, her you don't ass. bring up his name. Please don't bring up his name. Okay, okay. Don't bring up okay. His name. I don't want to say nothing bad about that man because it's, it's right here. It's right here. I don't want to say I it. Understand. I so understand. You know about Tessa? I'm just saying. Bloggers are they bloggers? I don't know, but we here for the mess, y'all. If y'all don't want to be the mess, we gonna we gonna 
we gonna cut out. But no, me and Kendra are actually cool. I actually spoke to her. Yes, we did have a riff, and that's, I ain't talk about right. it because it's on the next episode. But it's yeah. good. I don't have no problem with Kendra. I ain't no problem with Toy. I didn't think you don't have no problem with nobody. This conversation go over closets and we good. Then when I bring up SBA, she says that I'm over talking her and trying to make her look dumb. We going to pray for everybody. We going to pray about it, but I'm going to go back and get it to work because you're going to make me lose my job and I'm going to have to yeah, lose your job. Smiles. Yeah, I'm on break. Okay, go back to work. We ain't tell you to call me either. Go back to work. Thank you, Dr. Emily. I ain't talking about C, so we're going to leave him out of it. We're going to leave him out of it, y'all. Y'all say he says Because she said that she loved when Kendra got in your ass. Did Kendra read you? Kendra, well, I can't really say because it's on the episode coming up, so they'll show it. Yes, we got into it. Ken well, I ain't gonna say nothing bad about Kendra because I ain't got no problem with Kendra. But she, but Tori was saying she loved the fact that Kendra got into it, got in your ass. That was she. Would I be wrong to say that Jocelyn ran her ass off our own show when she read her and her husband ass? Let's talk about it. I mean, if you want to bring shit up, we can bring shit up. And y'all, yes, I'm gonna be messy today, girl. Yeah, yeah, agree. Uh, we don't want nobody to lose their job, okay? <laughs> no, for real, Maddie. And I ain't gonna give it too much more light, but I really do feel like Toya wanted with me because she's a hater. My whole thing was I ain't do nothing but compliment her. Her house is beautiful. I will say that. She showed her house. She was here. Yeah, her house. We were cool. I thought. But anyway, we gonna pray. I think Toya's being freaking. It's not a good look. It's not. We were cool. I ain't got no beef with Toya, so I don't know why she's saying all of that. Well, maybe I mean, because Dr. Simone asked her. You know, they were they were talking about you know the the L.A. people, and and she brought her. She asked her, "Had you interviewed her?" She said, "Hell no, I ain't interviewed no heavenly." Wow. And, and then she said they went. They were talking and talking, and then she said, um. Uh, and what she did like the most. Damon gave him the first job. He surely did. But I don't think Eugene said nothing bad. I'm leaving a man out of it because I really like Dr. Eugene. I don't think he said nothing bad. I don't think he would do that. I'm they watching it. I'm watching it. He ain't, they ain't ragging you. It's just that, you know, to, it, it does seem like Toya got a look. Got a look. Maybe y'all need to. But why? We didn't do nothing but have a good time. She get on live with Simone and it all come out. And all I'm saying is it's some haterade shit. I ain't did shit to Toya. I haven't. Let's see. Hey, Key, what's up? Hey, Dr. Heavenly. All I want to say is Dr. Heavenly serve they ass on a hot ass platter right now. Go in on they ass right now. Yeah, I see right that now. Now. Let's see. Let's see. You ain't even see the live, did you, Key? Key, did you see the live? I didn't. I, didn't, I just came <laughs> in, but they coming at Dr. Heavenly, so we going to war. I've been here every day since day one. Get their ass. Get but their you, ass, Dr. Heavenly. But sister, you got to have, <laughs> before you get somebody, you got to have the facts. So, so this is what makes a good read. When you when she get a she got to be able to see it so that she can formulate a good read from it. You know what I'm saying? You got to go watch what a person says today, so that when you not to not to basically really refute what they saying, but in order to formulate a good read. You got to be able to go over the fandango they words and shoot it back at them. Like she was showing her kitchen, her dining room, you know, stuff like that. See me if I was Doctor Heavenly and and she and she came from me and Doc and I I've been in Doctor Heavenly dining room and I looked at that dining room. I'd be like, well, you know, there's a big difference between you know uh, a Chick Fil A dining room and um you know the grand palladium dining room like there's a big difference in between you know I, you know you got to be able to formulate a nice i can't watch it beast frazier they blocked me i can't see it be major I, i'm just going Damn, they blocked you and they blocked me i can't see <laughs> but listen yeah. i'm just gonna try to in, in, in encourage you guys and entertain y'all i'm not mad i realized simone not my friend i really thought she was but i don't think she is anymore and you got to understand the questions that simone asking she's instigating an answer you know what i'm saying and it i don't, don't be a messy all the, tweets, all the tweets that her husband did they were they were conversations they had in their household they've been hating so my whole thing is eh, y'all trading your friends for a paycheck that's what y'all doing Mm -hmm. 
She said you shouldn't market your business on the show. That's the dumbest shit ever. That's the dumbest shit ever. T.S. Madison, you shouldn't market your business on the show. And to me, she ain't even talk about me. She got to be talking about Jackie. Yeah, that's the craziest shit ever to do because you don't know how long you're gonna be on TV. You just so you got to make your first season last last to be the rest of your season. And if, if anybody gets a television show, they better be on that show because that's that ain't nothing but a big commercial. It shouldn't be about somebody windmill and fighting, pulling hand, all this stuff. That's all that's, I'm saying. I say you need to medical that, parts but of you it. Also should be promoting your shit too. Really? Yeah. Yeah, promote your business, make more money. You that's got to make her that's a major shit because I think she was talking about Jackie with that because Jackie's promoting her book. But the thing about it is, Jackie's book is owned by Andy Cohen, so you know they're gonna promote it on the show. <laughs> that's just dumb. And think about <laughs> nobody's husband, but her husband promoted his damn app on the show. And I don't know if he's promoting the damn um real estate, but he should be. That don't make sense to me. I mean, they just here talking. I'm looking at it, Dr. Heavenly. They talk, you see, like we talking. So yeah. they, I'm going to get Dean Messy for just being in the middle of the situation. <laughs> Whatever. But they here talking, and it did look, look like Dr. Simone was very much so a look. Was a look, was a look, you know, a look. Kind of like the shit I do. I edge your person to see what they got to say about it. I'm going to edge you like, so what you think about, or so how you, it was just a look at, you know. And then Toya was a little, mm, you know, it was kind of like a little shady, like a little shady, but I don't know if it's, the, if it's some spill the tea shade. You ready to go in and spill tea on people. <laughs> okay, well, let's get our facts together. Had y'all not blocked me, I would have been able to see it for myself. But I did hear a bitch say something about uh, me and Jackie's friendship or something, and I corrupted her mind or something. Nobody said that. That's what I heard, man. We gonna pray. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Like, dog, like they weren't really, you know, had their claws in your back, like stank pussy and all that kind. I ain't, I, I ain't even get into. <laughs> but from what I, I, I went out with that, and I went on in. I thought she had said it. She no, but see, from what I'm surfacing on, it was just like it was a little edge, and like, so what you, you know, like how you feel about that? And it was, and you know, Toya already feel, I, it already seems that like she got a little. She ready to snap at you at any second. You know, a little snappy at you. I got that hater rate, and there's nothing I can do about it. I can understand her, what's wrong with her. There's a whole bunch of successful doctors on the show, right? She don't, she don't got shit to do. I, I don't put her down for it. She act like she don't want to do shit, but in the, in the end, it's it's hater rate there. It's hater rate there. I never said nothing negative about the girl house. The girl started talking about my house soon as she got approved for the loan. They didn't get that on the show. So I was like, okay, Toya, we can do it. But you can't really compete. I'm sorry. But we don't be good with Toy. Toy's looking for a storyline. She's trying to secure her check and let me help her. Oh. That's okay. what I'm doing. So we're going to pray. This is my girl here. I'm going to bring her in. Good morning, Dr. Heavily. Listen, I did not see love. But this is what I peaked um, the last time we were live with Toya. Toya thinks she's a rich white woman in her mind. And that's why she got offended when we started talking about rich white women and the difference between rich white women and different um, rich black women. So she, there's a different standard. When you mention, um, when we mentioned the mediocrity and the comment that Amarosa made, there's a different standard. And so she plays on that other side of the standard. So she's offended when you start mentioning stuff like SBA because she lives on the other side of the standard. That's my opinion. But you know what? It wasn't even about the business. I said, she said, okay, we talked about closets. What else can we talk about? Can we talk about healthy lifestyle? And I said, Toya, on my show, we talk about everything. We talk about business, money, and finances. We talk about relationships. She said, business? It's the quarantine. Why the hell would you talk about business? Because that's not on her radar, Dr. Heavenly. I don't think that's on her radar. So I said, we talk about SBA loans and PPP. And she was like, well, you trying to make me, I I'm paraphrasing now. You're trying to make me look dumb. And then she took a pause and looked up SBA. And she says, well, my accountant put stuff in simple form for me. SBA is small business. So to me, the people I know, I wasn't trying to be funny. I understand that. I and I got you. That's why I kind of pipe down, like, okay, 
I see what this is. I don't want this conversation to go left. Because I like Toya. And I like you two together. Y'all are a lot of fun together. I honestly would love to see a lot more scenes with you guys together. Because y'all are a lot of fun together. But we understand, Toya. You have, you, you're living on um, a different set of rules. <laughs> so don't be offended because my rules say I go hard. I go hard in the paint. I do everything in my power to make it happen. I grind. That's what I do. And don't be offended when I talk on that level. But that, that ain't even no level in my opinion. We weren't even talking about anything that deep. I just, you well, know. I, okay, I, I, I see it like this. When you are uh, working on your master's, you don't talk in the same jargon as someone that is just completing high school. And no shade. Right, right. So, so who got you know, fired? You, huh? Who got fired? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. This is what's going on. I'm looking at it, and it's just all in the who got fired? Somebody got fired from, from according to this. It well, was a it was a hint that somebody got fired. Did they say who it was? All right, we're we gonna bring somebody else in, baby. We just entertaining the folks. I'm not mad. I'm just saying we're gonna keep this check going. We're gonna help Toy keep her check, okay? Because I <laughs> and it's some fake bullshit to me. Because I'm sure. And well, I hope y'all get through it. And I hope y'all get through it and your relationship um sustains this little no relationship. Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm going to bring Kenny in. I want to hear Mayo's point of view. So we don't want to give it too much. We're going to talk to T.S. Madison in a second. We ain't going to give it too much more. Hey, Kenny Ken. Oh, shit. We can't hear you. Are you on mute? Turn your volume up. No, sometimes they may, may need to come out and go back in. That's I'm you. Go back in. I'll bring you right back. I'll bring you right back. Go out and come back in. I'll bring you right back, Kenny Ken. I'm going to look for you. I got a well, several people waiting to come in, but I'm gonna bring him right back. Hey, Scotty, how are you? What's going on? Hey, Maddie. Hey, man. Hi, baby. Did, did so, you watch the live? Did you watch it? I did. I'm okay. seeing it watching the live. So, man's point of view, because I can't see it. I was blocked. So tell her it wasn't that bad. It wasn't, it wasn't bad. bad. It wasn't I did. Bad. I watched it, but I feel like it's all calculated for them to have a storyline for next season. Right. Right. Okay, well, let's give them a storyline. Hell, come on, man. You now, know they can't take you, Heavenly. But, <laughs> was, but, but, did, but didn't Dr. Simone look like she was edging it, edging it just a little bit for Toy to say some stuff? Yeah, Simone was being, uh, Simone was kind of getting yeah, uh, Toy to like edging it, you know, and it did, like, because I'm seeing, looking at it now, and I can't even hear it all the way in its, in, in its entirety, but it seemed like she was just edging it, and you know, Toy was throwing her head around like, bitch, you know. Bitch, I, I, you know, it's very. <laughs> it makes Toya come off as fake though, because she talked about Mariah like a dog. But I thought they supposed to be friends. She oh, says Mariah. Yeah, they was talking about Mariah. Uh, about uh, she got what what comes around goes around because you know she didn't get a contract and she was just oh. like this ain't. She was like this ain't no Mariah pity party and all of that. Also, oh, this know, is girl did beat her ass the first season. <laughs> she about her daughter when she never said anything about daughter. Toya probably been waiting for that get back. She's so, she yeah. she was Mariah's friend, right? Yeah, and she was like, somebody's always waiting <laughs> oh. around to take your job. So what goes around comes around. Damn. Oh, Damn. yeah. They talked about quad. I feel bad for Mariah now. Y'all gonna leave her alone. Now, because to me, some of the shit I think go on, I think that some of the shit Mariah has said might be, I don't know. I feel bad for her. I, I don't feel bad for her. I, f I feel like Toya you don't feel what goes around comes around. But she had on a t-shirt about blocking me because she had blocked me. Did she, <laughs> did say that? Yeah, she had on a t-shirt. <laughs> she posted oh. this t-shirt. And she okay. actually... Go ahead. So so that's who they alluding to got fired. That that's who they alluding to got fired is Mariah because then they started talking about they was talking about how Mariah the one who put it out herself that she didn't get a contract and Toya and so I think Simone and Caesar was like oh Caesar was trying to go to bat for Mariah or something but she was like we not doing no Mariah pity party she was like Mariah has caused this on herself so what goes around comes around she was like somebody always waiting to take your job you should have upheld your end of the bargain or whatever she was saying. But she kind of went in on Mariah, so it make it making me sad. I told you, favorite. Who's the least favorite? Did you see that part? Uh, I didn't see that part. Okay. 
Uh, she was going to bat for quad and Mariah must have been. Yeah. Caesar should have stayed up out of it. I get, but this is my question. This is my question to y'all. Okay, so y'all on the same platform, right? Right. And I know y'all always say men shouldn't get into the women's stuff, but I feel like it's in some instances, it's like an even playing for you. I get what you're saying, though. I get what you're saying. No man should ever, you know, diminish a woman and talk bad to a woman. And I'm going to ask you one question, and I don't mean anything derogatory by it. Are you gay? I am. That's sure. That's the difference. I'm telling you, that's the difference. I'm talking about a straight man gets that you don't get in shit with women. You know what I'm saying? Because you got your ass beat as a child. I ain't not trying to go left, but I'm. But saying, I get what you're saying. Man, don't get in women bullshit. That's some gay shit. That's what. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm so serious when I say that to you, and I don't mean any disrespect, Scotty. I, know, I know you don't. We I, and I get it. Shit. They do. I don't see how you in the background talking. <laughs> Some men ain't playing about their wives. But, but, oh, you, but, but you know the straight men gossip way more than the gay men. Going oh, yeah. to a barbershop. Oh, going yeah. to a barbershop. Oh, oh yeah. That's not a great male, male, male uh characteristic. I wouldn't want my man out there gossiping. That's some bitch shit to me. It is. It is some whole shit. It is. I mean, come on now. If you're gonna say three things about me on Twitter and I say one thing <laughs> about like y'all man forever. What but you was, with me? But you would stay facts. You would stay stuff they can't fix. You could go fix your pressure washing your house. He can't fix getting fired from a oh, job. No. <laughs> I think all men gossip. I think the, the part of it is is when you're joning with people's wives. Like I can only speak for my husband. My right. husband would never get on Twitter and say anything negative about somebody else's wife. It's just not in his character. And maybe I'm wrong to think that way because I thought most men were like that. I think, you know what I mean? Why would you get on, you know what I'm saying, Twitter and talk about reality tv and dog the women saying stuff like yeah you got you got all these patients but you you know uh these celebrities but they ain't paying you who you talking about oh who you Caesar, talking about season need to find some constructive to do That's all I'm, saying. I'm not talking about no <laughs> husband but i'm saying i'm talking about my man my man wouldn't do that kind of stuff he just wouldn't and i thought that most men would not do that on reality tv because when it comes down to it you could say whatever on twitter but when you're in a man's face you don't say none of that shit that's true. That's cowardly. And I ain't talking about nobody. I'm talking about in general. I'm not talking about nobody husband. I'm saying anytime. I'm talking about even like even like Trump. All the shit he said. But now Trump will say it to your face. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm just saying it's so easy to go in on people on social media. That's why I have people show their face in here. And it's just a lesson. I mean, I ain't mad. This is a show. I get who my friends are here and I get who my friends are not. So do you feel like you should, should you look at these people as friends or just castmates? Because at the honestly, end. Honestly, Scotty, I really thought Simone was my friend. I did. And maybe I was wrong. Maybe I was So wrong. were y'all friends before the show? No, we weren't. But we became friends. I wasn't friends with Jackie before the show. I did not know her before the show. But I feel like she's my real friend. So do you feel oh, like I they put. For the show, and I know Toy is doing this for a check. I get it. Right. So, I'm so do you feel like they put. Simone in a compromising position too because I kind of got some intel on stuff that goes on behind scenes of reality TV how they may say hey bring this up or do this so do you feel like they told Simone she need to amp her drama up and let's be honest you are that person on the show to have drama with because you know you yeah. know how, <laughs> so it, yeah. like yeah. if I if I go toe to toe with heavily then my spot gonna be secured I feel like that's how a lot of them look at it because you're that person on that show to go toe to toe with. Well, what so about Quad? Like, what about Quad? I feel like Quad is, but Quad, she will go toe to toe, but Quad ain't going to, she ain't going, you know, Quad will walk away from the drama. She'd be like, I don't have time you know, for this. Quad will put some shit out there and cut your ass up and walk away. <laughs> <laughs> I love Miss Quad, but Quad, Quad ain't nobody to really play with either. She do her shit, but she do it in a different way. Yeah. Girl, they is still on here talking about this stuff on too long. I'm going to leave it alone, y'all. I'm going to leave it alone. But I do feel like, okay, there is some issues there that we need to address. And I think it's really petty for somebody to say, hey, I'm not going to be your friend because somebody else is a friend to you. That's dumb. That is. It's childish. So, so how do you feel about the Quad and Mariah situation? I think that it's time for forgiveness. I feel like it's time for forgiveness. I feel like, you know, I was sick of it. We were sick of it. Everybody was sick of it. I don't like Mariah. I've been very clear based on the stuff that she's done to me and other people, which have been way below the belt that I feel like was horrible. You know what I'm saying? 
But if Simone could forgive her for the shit she did to her, then I have to forgive. If Jackie could forgive her for the shit she did, if Toya could forgive her for the shit, which don't look like she forgave her, she would just be a <laughs> And now she bringing the real shit out. Fuck her. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I, I feel like... Somebody friend, I'm a solid friend. That's what I'm talking about, Scotty. And I don't understand this shit. Like, if I'm cool with you, I'm cool with you. I'm not gonna let a new bitch come in and, and ruin my reputation, Jackie's reputation, and then they stand behind the new bitch, knowing she was lying. To me, that was fucked up. Oh, Buffy. Buffy brings on a new bitch, Jocelyn Hernandez, to read Toya ass. <laughs> But now you cool with Buff. It, it just don't make sense to me. I, this is reality TV. Which one of y'all got executive producer credit? Me. Oh. No, I'm lying. I'm lying. I, <laughs> I, I don't. No, I think Mariah has ex executive producer credit, but it, it, she doesn't have any control. But she does have the executive. She does have that. I thought she sold it. She sold the show, but it's a vanity title, meaning that her name can still appear. Yeah, because I'm reading that down here because that's a part of the conversation, too. Okay. What they so, say? What does executive producer mean? You can fire people? No. You don't have the right to hire or fire. The hire chip look like to me if she's looking for a contract. I'm not talking bad about nobody. <laughs> I'm not talking bad about nobody. She got the credit, but she was looking for her contract is what she's saying. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know. I ain't got nothing to do with it. But Scotty, you got anything else? I got people waiting to come on back in. That is it. Thank y'all so much. Y'all have a great day. What's up, baby? Hey, baby. Hey, Maddie, what's up? up? Hey, boy, how you doing? I am chilling. I just got off work. I'm essential. And um, I just wanted to come in and tell you guys I love y'all. I popped in on the conversations. I got a comment on that, but I'm trying to be quick so I can get in and out. Um, Heavenly, do you remember me from the Portia Fox show? Yeah, now that you said it, yes. How are you? I am the guy that called when you was on the morning show. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm living by myself. I can't keep it. I can't do what I can't do right. <laughs> yeah, like, what's going on? I'm I'm just single. I don't need no relationship advice today. You already handled that on the Portia Fox show. But I called in because um I wanted to talk about the whole situation that's going on with this whole call and all this live going on and stuff. Did I think we can live. Did you watch the live? I did not watch the live, but I think we can settle this with three letters. A three letter word. Job. Cecil need a job and Toya need a job. And Heavenly, you can't be messy and you can't say it. But damn it, I'm going to say it. They both need a job. And if they get mad at me, tell them to call me. I'm in the DMV. Come see me when quarantine is over. So it's, it's, it boils down to a job. All right. Th that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Well, well, I mean. But we're going to keep letting them live it up. Not paying your taxes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Oh my Man, God! We need to get off this live. <laughs> now. Let's talk about the skin. Oh my talk God! What? What happened, T.S.? Yes. What happened? Y'all listen. So these was the text. Mm. T.S. is me. <laughs> she did not have to do that. <laughs> what is going I'm on? Entertain y'all. Honestly, I'm not mad at nothing. I don't have nothing to be mad at. My man at work. My daughter in school. I ain't got shit else to do. So let's talk about it here. Exactly. What did uh, I say, T.S.? No, I'm just, oh my God. What happened, girl? Man, I'm just see <laughs> before I comment, I'm, I got to I got to be deep. I like to do investigations and just oh, read it. Man. They uh, here for the mess today. Let's bring somebody to Ken. I appreciate you, baby. Thank Come you, in. I love you. Love you too. Bye. 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 He's so sweet. Hey, yeah. how you doing? That's my friend. What's up? Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, T.S. Madison. Oh, my God. I can't believe I'm online with T.S. Madison and Dr. Heavenly. That's the story. <laughs> That's the okay. story. Why would be a friend of the show and not a cast member? Did they say that? No. No, no, no. They did not say that. I just finished watching the live. I was watching it long while I was going along, so I can tell you all the tea. It was okay. three lives, you know that, right? It was more. It than was one. three lives. I didn't watch the first one with the LA chick. I didn't watch that. that I watched the, the second part and the third part. Okay. That's okay, on the first part, 
Mm. Let me tell you something. Toya is mad at you, Dr. Heavenly. She came in on the live mad. What? She she came in, her mic was messed up. They couldn't hear her. So when she came in, she was like, Oh, I thought my mic was messed up. I thought I was still muted and blocked. Like um when I came on Dr. Heavenly Live. So that's how she came in. So she mad at you about that, Dr. Heavenly. I need you to know that. Okay. Yeah. So then okay, so then we go fast forward. Now she say, Kendra, she loved Kendra because she got in your ass yeah. in the LA. Yeah. She said she can't she can't wait. For us to see it because she loved the fact that she got in your ass, she read you for filth, yeah, and you couldn't do nothing with it. Yeah. Yeah. That was gonna beat my ass. I ain't even gonna lie, that girl was ready to <laughs> beat that ass. <laughs> ass down. I'm gonna tell the truth. He didn't read me, I actually read her, but she got so angry. The bitch jumped up in my face, and I was like, Hold up, this ain't love and hip hop. I set my ass down. <laughs> <laughs> really love Kendra. She's a beautiful spirit though. I don't want no beef with her because I don't want my ass whipping. I can't beat that bitch ass. Contessa, why not? Heavenly, why was Contessa? You know Contessa had your back. Friend, she was all in, in uh, Britain for she, she had abandoned me because I was her girlfriend when we were in Atlanta. But when she get around Britain, she treat me like a fat Oh my gosh. Okay, so wait. All right. So then he went on from there, right? And they was asking, well, who is the most hated um cast member on Married to Medicine Atlanta? So this is when uh Simone exit stage left because Toya said that it's the people that don't got a contract no more, the people that got fired. Yes. That, that's what I was sitting here looking at. Yes. That, that's why I was asking those questions like, well, who got fired? You know what I'm saying? And I said that Toya was, it, Toya had a little, she does have some, uh, some aggression towards you, whatever yes. it is. Yes. She got some aggression. I mean, I got but they were drunk. They were drunk. They yeah. were drunk boots. You're talking about Mariah. Mariah beat her ass by the pool. <laughs> mama and her mama. But yeah, and her mama. So I'm saying if she said that, that's fucked up. Yep. Like, girl, for the last three seasons. But then it makes me think back when people said that they paid Toya to be her friend. Toya need a check, bitch. She gonna get any kind of way she could get it. I ain't mad at her. I ain't I'll mad. Listen, I only know what the people said. And what the people said, it was a lot going on in the lives. Hey, hey, uh, legally, Leah. Ain't nobody ever gonna have a whole story. It's always gonna be three, four. So if you were looking for the whole story, you on the wrong page. We just talking shit, really. Yeah, it was just pure entertainment because they were drunk. They were literally, you could see it in Cecil's eyes. They were drunk. Yeah, they were drunk. That's what I, my mom always said. You speak your sober man when you're drunk. Yes, yes. Drunk. Cecil, yes. Yeah. And Cecil was taken up for Mariah because um, Toy said she does respect the fact that Mariah got on. Um, on IG and put out the fact that she didn't get a contract. She don't respect that. And so Cecil was asking her, like, why you don't respect that? Why why couldn't she come out and speak on that or whatever the case is? So he said she don't respect it. Um, I, I don't know. The, the, end, the ending of the uh, third part of the live was just Cecil and um, Toya talking back and forth, gossiping like little chicks. So that's how we ended. But yeah, that's, that's the bulk of the tea. Y'all know I don't like Mariah, but I thought it was funny. I thought it was funny how she went to her, 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 her I thought it was funny and I thought it was attention seeking because I don't believe shit she say. Like I believe that anybody can get a contract in the beginning, the middle, or the yep. end of the season because I've seen it happen. If I've enough seen, drama come up. And I've seen people come on here and film the whole season, tell them they forecast, and at the end of the season, they tell them they not. So anything could happen. Her look about contract was a joke in my mind to seek attention. So all these people could say, oh, she's a black producer. They treating her wrong, whatever, to bring that shit up. Was she not a black producer? They did wrong as a black producer, as a female, they sold her shit. So let's yeah. get there the truth. Yeah. But Toya ain't shit, no. Way. That's what I'm learning, and I'm gonna give y'all toy and shit because she pretended like she was Mariah's friend. She pretended on my show like we was cool. What did I do she, to help but uplift her? I don't know. She mad at you though. She got some real, some real yeah. aggression inside. Yeah. It is there because, like, when yes. I, I couldn't even hardly hear hear it all the way. But from what I was, because she can't, because Doctor Simone was. She was itching now. Wasn't she itching it like she was pushing it? She was pushing it. She'll push it and then she'll back up. Yeah. Like, girl, say what you gonna say. Say what you gonna say. Say it. We don't want this. Simone don't want none of this. <laughs> it's okay. 
That's okay. We're going to save it for the season. But I think, honestly, uh, 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 what's your name? I can't see it. I B. am Brown. B. Brown. I B. honestly Brown. think they're setting up storylines. I think this is some fake bullshit. I think Me, so too. They don't have no beef. We don't. What are we beefing about? Both our husbands are ER docs. They work together. They help each other. Each other, you know what I'm saying? Um, but this will be a Lisa great storyline. She don't have a storyline. All I'm saying is she using me for a storyline, but shit, I need one too. So fuck it. If you want to do it, <laughs> but Heavenly, you are the one who has gotten away for so long, not having a storyline and just keeping up all the shit. We like you keeping yeah. up the shit. Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying that. You I'm just saying that's honest. We like you keeping up the shit. You don't gotta come tell none of your business. You and daddy business. You come with all the shit. We love it. We love it. Yes, man. <laughs> she gonna end up saying your mama. I understand. That's what it is, and it's okay. It's okay. She gonna end up saying your mama. Your mama. <laughs> no, for real. For real. Simone and Jackie been friends for real for years, which hurts my heart. I mean, fuck me. I learned her. I, I met her on the show. And I really had to learn painfully that she wasn't my friend. She was there for a check. But to throw Jackie under the bus and say shit like she got all the celebrity patients because they ain't paying her or say stuff like, oh, we shouldn't be promoting shit on the show. When Andy co-signed her book, his name on the book, so you know we promote. That's what we do on the show. Ask Candy. What do you do on reality TV? That's one of the purposes of doing it. Hello? You get promotion. That's dumb as hell. But then you got to go back. It's a husband tried to promote an app. He's, well, I ain't going to go into that. But he, he <laughs> promoted an app. So how are we saying that we can't promote shit on the show? That's some haterade shit. And then go back and y'all tell me if it's true or not. But I believe it is. She said she didn't want all them patience. Hell, she don't need all them patience. What's that? Some haterade shit. If you got more and more patients, that's what you want. You hire an associate. You hire a nurse practitioner. You get the money, right? Listen, smart. I respect. I respect the fact that Simone is a doctor, but I feel like Simone might be a lazy doctor. Like she don't want to do too much. She want to do the bare minimum. I mean, we all learning from Candy, y'all. I, I promise you. I think she's my mentor in this shit. You For sure. Her, she came with a plan. You cannot say you shouldn't be promoting shit on the show. Now that's At just all. dumb. That's the dumbest shit. You need yeah. to promote, promote, promote as much as you can. You are your brand. Don't That's all I had to come say. Hey, shit. She get paid. The insurance company pay for your baby. How many of y'all got babies out there? You got a baby? No, I don't got no kids. Hey, I, got a baby. I ain't pay shit. The insurance pay good for the babies. Now, dentistry is a little bit different. You coming out the pocket for dentistry, okay? We're going to pay a little bit. But insurance pay for your baby. So they ain't got to pay. Anyway. Don't let them fight you, Dr. Heavenly. Please, I don't want the girl. to fight me. Why they messing with me, though? Dr. Heavenly, I'm going to need that Miami to come up at you. Oh, no. I'm, in I'm from Tampa, Tampa, Florida. I'm going to need that Miami to get come on up at you. Yes. Yes. That's right. That's right. I'd be rooting for you. I'd be like, come on, Dr. Heavenly. Get him. Everybody got their 20%. Some people love heavily, some people hate heavily just based on the story. And to me, I think a lot of people like Toya because Toya is no threat to anybody. You know what I'm saying? She just ain't. People like Toya because people like to hate on people that got it going on. Toya ain't doing shit, ain't trying to do <laughs> what are people that don't have I say up your haters. If you got a lot of haters, you're doing the thing right. That's what I think. Am I wrong? That's true. That's true. I need you to repeat that line. What you said about Toya? <laughs> I what? said she's not a threat to anyone. That's okay. I like her because she's not a threat to anybody. You know what why, I'm saying? Why is that? Why is she not a threat? She don't have shit going on. I said it. She, yeah, she don't have shit going on. <laughs> oh, oh, that's the part that I forgot. She was talking about how she take care of her man because she was saying that when when her man get home from the hospital, he got to come through the garage and take all his clothes off and um. He, he walked through the house and go to the room and get in the shower and she don't have no clothes laying out for him, no, because she be done slayed over the stage, um, um, slayed over the stove and cooked for him and all this, that, that and other. I'm, I don't know. They was drunk and just kicking it, honestly. That's what I think. It was a, a bunch of drunk people and it wasn't no social distancing going on. So I thought we had the corona going on. They both had at least 10 people at their house. I'm just saying. Did she say this? She shaded Jackie saying she's chasing the money and does not spend time with each patient unlike her. That's amazing. I didn't, see that. I, 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 I didn't hear her say that. Up if she said that. I didn't hear her say that, though. Okay, so they said Shanique. I like Shanique because Shanique always says she take care of her husband. She love her husband and she likes to serve him. 
Okay, so that's why that's why she said that. That's why um Toya said that because Shanique had said in the previous live that she takes care of her man. She has um his pajamas ready for him when he get home from the hospital and all this that and other. So that's why Toya said I that. I love that about her. I mean, it's a pleasure and an honor for me to serve my man. I feel like he's worth it. If you don't feel like your man worth it, don't do it. True. T.S., what you got, girl? I'm just, <laughs> reading, the I'm just reading the comments down here. You get what I'm saying? I just and, and I, I love you. I love you, Dr. Heavily. And I just don't want them girls jumping on you. Oh, they gonna jump on me anyway. I ain't <laughs> no shit. They was coming for me anyway. All I'm doing is setting the shit straight before y'all start. Toya is fake as fuck. Oh, Jesus. It's as simple as fuck. Oh, You're not gonna be your, your friend, Jackie friend, because she cool with me. That's dumb. That's <laughs> dumb. That's 12-year-old bullshit to me. And if it ain't so, tell me what Jackie did for you not to be your friend. Because Jackie has never said anything negative about you. In fact, if you ask Jackie right now, before this, man, she might not say this shit now. But before this, she would have said, oh, no, me and Simona are cool. We'll always be good. I swear to God, that's all Jackie has ever said. She ain't never said nothing negative about this woman at all. But Jackie's backup is like, bitch, you done fell out with everybody on the show. I supposed to fall out with them because you fell out with them? And to me, I was nothing but a friend to Simone. I wasn't. Her husband started this shit. But my whole thing is, I felt like he was saying shit on Twitter that they had been talking about in their house, right? I think the shit he said was her voice. I looked at it. If I'm wrong, shoot me. It was definitely a conversation that was had. There was a lot of haterade going on. And look at it. Why? They never showed my house. They never showed my success. They don't even talk about the Well, they talk about the success of my husband. He has several business. But Toya put it out there. She said he's always had several streams of income. I don't know. I, I don't I don't even know if Toya is a hater. I just think she fake as fuck at this point. I don't think she a hater. She don't give a damn. She don't even want to do shit. So I don't think she a hater. I think Simone's a hater. But I don't think Toya hate her. I just think she she want to show. She want to be on the show. And they all coming for me anyway. Oh. I ain't shit to nobody. I love everybody. I had prayed before we got here. <laughs> you know, the lady waiting to come in, I be bright. You can come back. Let me get this girl in here. Okay. Thank you, love. Bye-bye. T.S. Madison, what you got to say about it before I bring anybody in? Listen, I, I'm just I'm trying to I'm trying to keep the peace until the TV show come on out. Then I want the Doctor Heavenly to come on. I want the Miami Heavenly. The only thing I'm terrified by is I don't want them girls to be in a game up on you. Have you in the corner? Uh 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 uh. uh, 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 uh this ain't loving hip hop. If if I was with Jocelyn Hernandez and Mama D and the girl that beat Mama D ass, I wouldn't be talking all this shit. I really wouldn't. <laughs> I really wouldn't. I would sit my ass down somewhere. I ain't fucking stupid. I ain't never been dumb a day in my life. Ever. So ever. what you're saying is these girls ain't got ain't gonna put no hands on you. You know that you bad. First of all, Simone is a doctor. I I now Toya might. I mean, they done had a fight before. But Contessa gonna get that. I got <laughs> back up, bitch. What? <laughs> I issue by myself. I was gonna fight. You know, ah! no, but I don't think we'll fight ever. I mean, we fight with our words, and I know my words cut deep, and theirs do too. I don't know why people look at my shit deeper than theirs because their shit is wrong too. Anyway, hey, sugar. Hello. Hey, everybody. Hey, TS. How you doing? How you doing? Hi, hey, Percy Heavenly. <laughs> Well, I just want to come in real quick. And they just make it shit up now. They make it shit up. She ain't say that. Is she? So he said, I'm all beat. You know what? You do like talk about people's mamas, though. <laughs> I just wanted to come on and just say, um, I just want to say thank you, uh, Dr. Heavenly, because I do review the show, and you have always shown me love. I appreciate it. Even on my reviews that I might not be saying real positive stuff about you because I try to keep it fair, but you always, you will leave a comment, you will retweet me or whatever. And I enjoy your reviews. When you started reviewing the show, oh my gosh, I was, I would get mad when you would skip a week. I'd be like, I know she probably down there doing, you know, busy with people's mouths and stuff, but where is the review? So I appreciate it. And I'm looking forward to um LA. It sounds like it's a whole lot. I missed all these lives. I gotta go back and look at them. It's not like it's a whole lot going on. Yeah, you gotta get them before they go because this they got a couple of hours left because this was oh. 16 hours. Oh, this is on Instagram. Oh, yeah, yeah I'm about to watch it right now. So yeah. 
Yeah, I'm gonna really get deep down into it before I do before I put it on the docket, huh? Because okay, I, don't put it on, on the docket. docket. Listen, let me tell you something. <laughs> Heavenly, my girl. But even she, my girl, I got to see the facts before I start weighing in on the case. Now, when we open up the live, we can confirm the bitch had a shirt say I block a bitch, and I'm the bitch that was blocked. We can confirm that. Yeah, but when you came on the live early, somebody told you they was talking about some stanky coochie and all this type of of stuff. So I had to rush over. I had to get. I had to duck down because all the coochie stank. And you went right to work on them. You went right to work. I was like. Because I ain't finna be getting in the line of fire with that shit. Hey, oh, I got, yeah, I got to go see what's going on. What that mouth do, What that mouth do? Tell Tell, I worked for the, uh, honey, listen, he don't want the enemy around here. Hey. <laughs> I look so bad. Hey. 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 I don't want to be reading a bitch on some shit that I ain't see, but right. I know if y'all talking about somebody coochie stank, I'm just saying Simone did say her coochie stank. She I did say that. She I ain't see that. that. I, I, ain't see that here. I ain't see that. No, 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 not on the live. She said it on the show. Oh, fact, that's not fiction. That's oh. not nothing I'm making up. She said it. She I did. It. I was like, damn, you're old bitch. Why, why your coochie stank? I don't know, but anyway. No, that's that's fact. That's not that's not a, <laughs> that's a fact. She said it. Pull that, hey, Google somebody say some you can pull that up, TS Madison. That's a fact. You got any questions, reality TV TV? No, I just wanted to come in and say thank you, but um, I'm gonna go catch all these IGs. Yeah, um, you and, you know, I catch you when it's on the docket. Yeah, you got to catch it because they're about to expire. You get I'm about to go watch it right yeah, now. You thank you for letting it. me come on. Huh? No, I was just gonna say thank you for letting me come on, and I was just I just wanted to say thank you. That's all. Thank you for letting me come on. Thank you, sugar. Y'all so sweet. Uh, where is hey, hey, my friend? Hey. Don't start. Don't start this shit. And I see Joan McCall. You coming next, girl? I ought to pull y'all asses in here together, but it'd be too many people talking. So hey, D, what's up? Nothing. First of all, Maddie, we love you. Hey, baby. You know we love favorite. Toy, I think we were down there. We kept telling her what was me. I can't hear you speaking. Can you hear me? A little bit. I said, yeah, Toy is jealous because she knew that y'all had that she had you muted. She just wanted an excuse. We told her a thousand times her phone was muted. T.S. Madison, what's on the docket tonight? Child, oh, no. I got to re I got to do my research on this. Dr. Heaven not finna have me in no grease because I'll get her some grease fucking with my sister. See there. She'll have me over some hot grease and I'm already supposed to be busting hair wide open as it is and I ain't got time to be. Don't, don't say that, Betty. Don't say that. Where do we get? We need to get yeah. Dineva. Where's Dineva? Dineva ain't answer the phone. That's what I was you never found Funky? Where she at? Nah, let me call fucking Dineva. Sasha T, is that fact, Sasha T, or is that... You know what I'm saying? At this point, I don't know what's real or what ain't, but that's how reality TV go anyway. We don't be knowing what the fuck real or what's ain't, so it really don't matter. Here, we gonna go in anyway. But I know she didn't say that. The mom, the mom has said something like this in the in the um hidden clip. They had this on the hidden clips that Simone has said something about Dr. Jackie chasing the money. When she was mad at Dr. Jackie. This was last week. You know what? Honestly, I, I want them to be friends again, so I'm going to leave this shit alone. I just think that that's that Jackie has never said anything negative about Simone ever. And I don't think there's nothing wrong with you say nothing. money for a, a, a career that you do. Is it wrong to get paid? Not at all. We should get money, don't it? Isn't that the goal to make money? Isn't this what the show is all about? Is for you to promote your business and make money? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Unless I don't know. That got me confused. Unless you don't have a job. Yeah, Dineva sleep, child. Dineva probably been down there to the bar. Getting up in a minute. Facts. Because yeah, she didn't like the smell. Okay, so what that mean? That's a fact. That's what she means. 
Well, thank you, Miss D. Bye. Bye, baby. Bye. 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 Hey, listen, we're just trying to entertain the folk, girl. What's up? Don't you say nothing bad. No, listen. You, you're going to let me speak today, Doc. Let's, I have to address Simone. I have to address Dr. Simone. Let me tell you, Doc. Simone was envious of you from the jump. You come in as a dentist. She been eyeing your husband, Dr. Damon. And then she said it on the show. She wished Cecil would be like your husband. So there it is. She wants your man. And then she is so jealous of you because of your man. And then to top things off, you and Dr. You and Dr. Where's my camera? That ain't you, a legend. Yeah, she said that. She, she, said, she said it. it. It's she not it. a legend. You're not, you're not watching the show, uh, Madison. She, she don't watch that. The show. She said it on the show that she wished her husband was like Dr. Damon. Which woman says that on the show? You understand? And then to top it off, you and Dr. Jackie became like this. Remember, she and Dr. Jackie were friends. You know, like back in grade school, you have your one little friend and, oh, you and I are so friend. Because Dr. Simone is weak. She is a weak woman, very weak. And she had Jackie in her corner. Then Dr. Jackie and you, Dr. Heavenly, start becoming friends. And she hated that because J Dr. Jackie was hers. Oh, she's my friend. She's my friend. She doesn't want Dr. Jackie to be friends with nobody else but her. And when Dr. Jackie and you started hanging out, that, that just picked her off. And so she's letting go to only, it's, it's, only a weak woman does that. She is weak. And yes, I said it. She's weak. But we were a threesome. She's the one that got me to like Jackie. I don't know how the hell this happened. Like to me, T, uh, Joan McKay, how it happened was to me, I was her friend. I was her friend. When Mariah started lying, Simone just flip flopped and moved to Mar Mariah's side. And I was like, well, damn, I thought we was cool. Because she's been jealous of you from the jump. She's been jealous of you from the get go. Uh, Dr. Simone's been jealous of you. She's been jealous of you. And she just wanted a way. You, you know, you know, like, like in girl code, Dr. Heavenly, you may have a girlfriend and that girlfriend is jealous of you. Um, secretly, she's jealous of you and she's bringing people around you, trying to, to, to put you in mess so that your mess can shine. That's what Heaven, uh, Dr. Simone was doing. She's been jealous of you from the get go. But from I was -go. Really hurt when she said that I put stuff out there that she told me in confidence. That was a straight up lie. And I was looking at her like, damn, bitch, you going to do this for a storyline? You saying I told you told me in confidence that man didn't have no job and you were you were, you, were, you said it on the show. She, she, did, say on the show. she did say it on the show. She did say it on the show. Like Heavenly's not a good friend. I am the best. I would love a friend like me. No, I'm because she. Another she way. I think she said it to you and she just never wanted you to repeat it. But she uh, she had already said it. She had already said it. So, I mean, if she put it out there, it's game for anybody to say. Maybe she didn't understand that. But once you put something out there, it's game for anybody else to say, it, pick it up and say it. Right. That's what I thought. And I, if it was something that was not said on the show, I really don't try to say it on the show. I may have made, I don't even think I've ever made that mistake. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. I've never said anything. Now, I do, Joan, and I'm a messy bitch. I am. And I think my <laughs> shit. And we, and we love the mess. We love the mess. Know. I really don't. And if I do, I'm sorry, but I, I didn't do shit to Simone. I swear to God. When Mariah came with the receipt shit, she immediately jumped on the side and said, you know what? If she said it, it must be true. And I think like, Mariah has said all kind of shit about you. Does that mean it's true? It's It's been jealousy from Simone. She's been jealous of you from the jump. From the jump, she's been jealous of you. She's just been jealous. You're successful. Your husband is successful. As a, Together, you are a team. You don't speak ill of your husband. Your husband doesn't speak ill of you. Your husband doesn't get up in the, in, into the girl's thing like, like her husband does. So she's standing in the background and looking at your life, looking at the way you're living and wishing wanting her life to be the way that your life is. That girl's been jealous with her overbite. Oh! <laughs> Joan, y'all gonna stop now. We gonna go somewhere else. We gonna go somewhere else, y'all. Joan from the island, she don't give a damn. Do she got that? I don't. Is that drunk with that? Damon don't drink like that. And to me, for her to put that out there like that, and he's a physician, a very well-respected physician, Damon can't drink more than two drinks. That's why I tell him don't drink, because he gonna be, he can't drink over and over and over again. 
So that's something that she embarrassed about. Don't put my man in that shit. That's all I'm saying. Damon ain't saying shit about nobody. Leave him alone. And 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 her husband. I mean, she needs to because like some people in the live said that she is the husband and Cecil Cecil is the wife. She needs to let her husband know that listen listen sir certain things just don't get when girls are at it stay back look at damon like she's been telling everybody she wants a man like damon she needs to say to her husband cecil start looking at damon and start trying to be like him <laughs> yo i you said don't, it. yo miss joan you don't have it do you hear me you just tore them up like Straight down the line. I'm gonna need me another drink. Hold on, shit. Hold <laughs> on, Miss Joan. I found out. That, I found out that the woman is jealous of Doctor <laughs> from you. Now I found this out from you. You done. You done she summed is. up. You done summed up the whole series. She is. She is. She's a. She's a. She's a. She's a pity. Lady, pity I used to woman. love Simone. So she was, I, I really did love her. And I can't say that with a real heart. I really did. But I swear to Jesus, she a flip flopper. Me and her were good. We didn't have no beef. She jumped on Mariah's side just like she jumped on Buffy's side. Buffy was a lying bitch. She know Jackie didn't say that with no ill intent. You know what I'm saying? And then, and, and then, and then, and then, and then, listen. Side and the shit Buffy was saying. But but listen to the Buffy scenario too, Dr. Heavenly. Now you're saying that she and Jackie were very good friends. Now if Simone was really true to Dr. Jackie all this time, she would have known that J Dr. Jackie didn't say anything with any ill intent. So she wouldn't have jumped on Buffy's side. She's no real friend. Dr. Simone is not a real friend in my eyes, but based on what I am seeing on the show, she's not real. She's not true. She's but not true. My thing is this, Toya. <clears throat> If you get to this bitch a flip flopper, you gonna be at that bed by yourself, girl. You know she a flip flopper. All I do is say two things and Toy and, and Simone on the next person team. Toy, you you you're doing the shit wrong, and I'm she's trying doing to it wrong. Smart, but but smart, she's doing. But then listen, allegedly, put up your allegedly, Madison. Put it up. Put it up. Allegedly, Maria Mariah is not on the show, right? Who is Toy gonna par with? Who she's gonna par with? If Mariah doesn't come back, they gotta be you? me. Can't be you after this. Are oh, you talking about pair with? I thought you said par, like par me. No, like be friends with. Who right, she gonna be it. friends with? Right. Doctor Heavenly, if if when you guys start taping again and the show comes back and I see you parring with Kaya, I'm gonna stop watching. I'm gonna be like, oh no! Where the hell is it? I'm gonna stop watching. Hey, bitch! I can't be your friend. Cause people gonna stop, stop watching because you a fake bitch is what they say. Exactly. If, That's if what they when, say. If when Martin Medicine come back and I see you pairing up with Ty and being oh friendly, friendly with Ty, I'm gonna stop watching because mm -mm. you would have lost it, Doctor Heavenly. You would have lost it. But the interesting thing is, and I'm not even lying, Joan McKay, I'll be for real on the show. Maybe that's why people be mad because I you don't for the cameras. I don't. I say exactly when it might get cut up and I might look mean as hell because y'all don't know the backstory. But I'm I'm not gonna fuck with you. I already know. But you're the realest, you the realest person on that show. The realest person on the show. And 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 it, it, it's because of you why the show is going on for so long because everybody every year tunes in to see what Dr. Heavenly is up to, what mess she's bringing, and Bravo knows this. Madison, <laughs> I love Joan, Dr. Heavenly. <laughs> I love Miss Joan. I love her. She, listen, she passionately, she passionately came in here and broke this shit down for me. She said she told me like this. Madison, bitch, sit your ass down. You don't even watch the motherfucking show. <laughs> Let me tell you how this bitch go. This is she jealous of you. This bitch got an old bite. I was like, wait a minute. Wait. Joe, I love you. And she said, now listen, you heard your fan. Dr. Heavy, your fan say, if you fuck with Toya on this show this season, she ain't fucking with the show no more. No more. A strong statement. Ain't a goddamn. What about forgiveness? Mm -hmm. Listen, listen, God did say forgive, but he didn't say be a fool. Joan, he did say forgive. Know. In the church a couple of times too, look. He listen. did say forgive, but he didn't say be a fool. Man, I like Joan. I, I all, I let, let me tell you this, Dr. Heavenly, they're all coming for you. They're all coming for you. They're going to come for you. They're going to try to wear you down, but just know that Team Heavenly is 
in the back and we are supporting you and not we're not leaving you and except for mary you. reese no, except look, for mary reese in the comments and, and, and i flip off and i say some fucked up shit y'all know why don't yeah. don't don't think that i just said it for nothing that's all i'm saying don't say that said nothing for nothing Praise God. We gonna and, thank and, you. And you better listen to this woman, Dr. Heavenly. She <laughs> said out her mouth. If you go over there and you fuck with Toya, they ain't fucking with you. But no you know, more. All I've done is uplift Toya, other than a few jokes. Y'all understand it. And she just got to you. Like her husband, though. For real. I really do like Eugene. I, think I do good. like Eugene, too. I do like Eugene. And um, I mean, when she went over there to, to Simone's page, she talked to Simone's life, Dr. Simone's life. She's talking about how you muted her, her, her microphone. She muted that microphone herself so she could show her house and show and show. Like, really? And she left all like the cars and went in our house. And I was like, Toya got furniture. All over, all over in our house showing everything. And then when she was, and then when she was done showing the house, she just out. She's, oh, I have to go. Bye. She muted herself. Okay, Coca-Cola, come on back in. She says she got the receipts. Coca-Cola, bring the receipts, girl, because that's what we like. We already said that, SL. We already yeah, said yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already said that. Well, we like Medicaid, too, after this corona thing. I might have to go back to seeing Medicaid, too. Don't talk about the Medicaid, corona. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know how y'all pockets going to be, but Medicaid pay every Tuesday morning. Amen. So I'm mad about Medicaid. I had tried to act funky with Medicaid and stop seeing them, but I bet you back after this corona thing, I'm going to be seeing them again because I don't know how y'all money going to be. That's right. We're going to see it. What you got, Maddie? I'm going to bring somebody else in. Thank you, Joan, for breaking it down. Thank you, Joan. Thank you, baby. You <laughs> watch the show, and she knows the show from first season to Man, the to I watched the first season of that show when that girl was whooping that girl and her mama by that pool. <laughs> I did watch that. Now I don't be, and I don't sit there and watch you read them girls and say your mama, your mama all every year. <laughs> and don't give a damn. And go, you that tell them every year. That was crazy. That fight by the pool was that fight by the pool was crazy. I was like, but how you and your mama get you know get get work put in on you? My mama, my mama would have might have tried to break shit up. She wouldn't have jumped in and started hitting the bitch in the head. Now, I don't think my mama would have that. I would have tried to get the bitch off the door. I wouldn't have hit her though. No, nah, my mom would have been putting some work in. <laughs> Work in. My mama been putting work in over there. My mama ain't with that. Now my mama don't condone all that foolishness, but she ain't finna be having nobody putting their hands and things on me. <laughs> you know what? I don't know who won the fight. Toya might have won the fight. I don't know. I didn't see it. I saw the girl on top of, but yeah, Toy was getting them punches in. So I don't know who won. I think it was probably even, but it was really messed up when the mama jumped in, and then it was just a mess. I don't know what the hell happened. But 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 Doc, Toy's punches weren't forceful punches. They were like. There weren't hard punches. Several times, TS Messer. So who won the fight? Who won? I, I mean, Bravo didn't show us everything, but I, yeah, I didn't think Toya won. I didn't, think, I didn't think she won because the punches weren't connecting. They weren't yeah, hard punches. They were just is, like it, baby right. punches. They, we they just, were, no, I just we no mamas and two, one, two, a girl, a mama, and one girl. I no. got like seven people waiting to come in. Uh, come back, okay? I love you. We'll come back. I'm going to get back to you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> come on. No, what's up? What's going uh -oh. on? What's going on? What's going on? Uh -oh. so, I, what's up, I'm in Florida. And uh, my dude from Carroll City, TS actually knows him, uh, your boy Tweety. Hey, um, boo. He hey. What's going on? Hey. All right, so I've been a fan of you since day one, Heavenly. Like, no bullshit. Day one, I was like, this crazy one right here, you got to watch out for her. Um, I actually watched all of Simone's live while when you actually first came on at 12 o'clock. I personally think, like, bitch, what do you, you have nothing else to do with your time. Like, what do you have, what do you have going on at this present moment where your husband is sitting on Instagram, on your page, being messy and cooking it up? And the fans in the comments saying, he messy, he messy, he messy, he messy. He messy. He cooking it up, cooking it up, and you just kiki 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 kiki. Then furthermore, you a damn guy in colleges, and you let your husband sit on there talking about coochie, coochie, coochie. 
What do you have for me? So the whole scenario was Toya was given an example as to if someone came into your office and their coochie stink, you still want to help them, but you want to light all it out once they leave. And Simone said, well, we accept good coochie and funky coochie. And so Cecil kept trying to cook it up. Oh, so um, does the coochie really stink? And she was like, you shouldn't be saying that because I'm a gynecologist. We say vagina. So with, why are you sitting here saying coochie? You have nothing better to do than you got the I'll block a bitch t-shirt on. For what? They can't take her. I am blocked. I can very, very well tell you that's who she talk about because I am blocked. She's talking about having I said the sad part is you can't take her. You can't take her because she'll stand up and let you know, bitch, you wrong to your face. She ain't gonna cut your, she ain't gonna cut it nothing. She gonna give it straight to you. Straight to you like that. And if you can't deal with it, yeah, if you can't deal with it, cut, shut your mouth. Toya, she ain't really like um old girl just said she need a J O B. But you know what? Honestly, I be feeling sorry for Toya for real. Really, I mean, to be around here with all these professional people, even like Quad, Quad got it going on. Even what? like Mariah, she's very, I, you know, and I don't even like the bitch, but you have to say she's very creative. <laughs> That's the first being around all these powerful women. Like you just in here getting back in good, but yet you buying these new houses and everything. Bitch, what are you doing? You need to make sure your money right before you go to the next step. Because you only. <laughs> Um, she was saying that um, now that Jackie has a new home, the new house is built, it looks nice. Um, hopefully, they'll get an invite, but they'll probably sure that will happen once Bravo cameras are on. Because <laughs> <laughs> now that was a shame. Because apparently, you and Jackie are much closer now than she and Simone because Heavens, her real friend. Where did she lean to the camera? Now that wasn't no lie. That wasn't no lie, Nico. Nico, she was telling the truth. That's true. I believe that. I believe that because Simone is. You can tell, like you wrote iffy. You, you seem as if you're okay with some people. Then you get back in good graces, and then the next scene, you at the mouth, at the mouth, at the mouth, at the mouth, at the mouth. So, um, I. I, if I was Jackie, bitch, you ain't coming to my house. How about that? I think Jackie see everything. I talk to her every day. I... Here, how about you come here the last day that we film? Bitch, this is the season finale. Now you can see what the fuck is in this house. She, they just, I don't know, Heavenly. Hey, I, that's all it is. I don't think, hey, think you're doing nothing wrong. You speak your mind. You state your case. You bring your facts. You bring your receipts. If they can't deal with it, then fuck them. And then she says, what? Your mama. Boom. Your mammy, actually. Mm. You know, that's your a mammy, bitch. bitch. Your mammy, bitch. You know, that's a, that's a, that's actually a Miami thing, you know. It is. Because Tiffany, told me the other thing. I like to be there watch the goes, Your mama is just something we say. Mm. Your mama is just something we say. You're from Carroll City, right? That's what we know. No, I'm from, I'm from uh, Virginia. I'm from the DMV, but he from Carroll City. So oh, I know okay. certain things that we use up north. Like, he like, oh, what that mean? All right, I got it. Now down here, I'm like, okay, what that mean? Okay, I got it. But like you said, so you done moved all the way down there with your babe from Virginia, bitch. Five years, and y'all been together this long period of time. Y'all look, yeah. I be on y'all Instagram liking y'all pictures and stuff like that. I be I all up seeing it. I five be like, you know, y'all some y'all get into a lot of things. I be looking. I was like, honey, where's the, where's the only <laughs> fan? I'm, I'm a wholesome Christian. I don't do none of that kind. I was of like, what the only fans at, honey? We <laughs> <laughs> right? No only fans right. over here. But I appreciate so you for having Tiffany me on. So said that oh. Simone flipped on Mariah for Toya. Yes, she did vote out the group. 100%. Simone flipped on Toya for Mariah. Yes, she did. 100%. Grace flipped on Mariah for Quad. Yes, she did. Season 100%. Three. That's true. Flipped on I have one question. For Lisa Nicole. Uh-huh. Um, Toya did say that, what's the girl's name from L.A.? That she, oh, she read heavily. Y'all can't wait to see. I don't know what episode's gonna be, but I, she read. The girl didn't read me like Jocelyn read her. What the girl did was she was fed to whip my ass. That's what she was gonna do. She didn't read me. I, I think I got with her ass, but when she jumped up and said bitch and all of this, I set my ignorant ass down. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> I said a whole lot of shit, and when, she, when the shit got real, I was like, damn, doctor. I sat down. Kendra, so, that's her name. Dr. Kendra. Kendra. That's her name. Yeah yeah, 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 but I like her though. I don't want no smoke with her. Yeah. She probably whipped the shit out of me and I sat my ass out because I ain't no damn fool. Okay. 
Do you but think would you battles? No, but would you read her? I did. I believe Heavenly Writer. I, I definitely believe Heavenly Writer. Because Heavenly will read a bitch and sit there. But I think Heavenly she reads. That, that's why I shut up. Dr. Heavenly Reads remind me of Phaedra Reads. Like, Ooh. they cut so deep. Is that deep. bad? Is like, that good? They, whew, like, they'll cut you so deep that you have to really sit back and like, damn, bitch, do I really need this job? <laughs> that's what I'm like, scared to fight my Can I really deal with her all I'm these scared they're gonna, I'm so scared they're going to fight my sister. That's what I'm scared of. They're going to fight but I think they try. She can hold her own. I think Heavenly can hold her own. I think, I think what, they, what they seem <laughs> to think is... All right, she from Miami. She in Atlanta now. She a dentist, but she don't have it in her still. They know she has a mouth, but I think if that one person actually does it, does something that takes you there, that's all she wrote. We'll see. That's all it takes is just that one person to keep trying and trying and to get in your face and do that little boop on your forehead. But listen, the, but Miss Joan told Dr. Heavily, see, she, she, she for she jealous. Shot. Some she, of she told Dr. Heavily, if you fuck with Toya after this, she not watching the show no more. And she meant that. She meant I, that shit. She meant that shit. I know she meant it. But the sad <laughs> thing is, like, I love Heavenly too much to the point where I could just stop watching the show. <laughs> like, I couldn't do it. And I would honestly, I probably would flip the channel, like, the scene she on a fast forward. It's kind of like Kimberly. Um, Girl, but as far as that go, you don't remember Cadillac Kimberly? I kind of vaguely remember that name. Was she from my? How do I know her? She for she Cadillac Kimberly is the one who said, "You all, everybody, about to kiss my ass, kiss my ass, everybody around the world, kiss my ass." She, <laughs> the, oh yeah, oh, she the one that had red. She the one that had red Eddie Long before Eddie Long had passed. No, no, listen, I. Yes. Man, she wrote. She read Eddie Long. She said, "Man, y'all, y'all blowing my phone up." My God, I've been told y'all in vlog number twenty-seven that Eddie Long was down there fucking them little boys. So what you th you get what I'm saying? To Cadillac Kimberly has the most deadliest. Yes, she's second to Kaya. Yes. You know Kaya mouth deadly. She's yes. second to Kaya to me. Yes, her to mouth me. is like baby. Cadillac Kimberly is is deadly. Yes, 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 you know, but I know you got the people on the live. I just want to hop on, yeah, I appreciate my case and um, make sure I left that message. But like I said, if you don't, man, fuck them heavenly, like you know who your friends are, you know who's not your friends. I you already know, who know, rock with, you know so who's solid, obvious. They made it so painfully obvious. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to be their friend and because now a lot of people have a lot of built up anger. During the COVID nineteen, like Simone said. <laughs> All right, All right baby. I'm see you next. All right, time. All right, Master, take care. Like All right, baby, love you. Love, love you too. Let's see. Coca Cola say she got the receipts. What's going on, Coca Cola? Come on. She got them. I am back, and I do not appreciate the people in the comments saying some bullshit about I lie. I didn't lie about motherfucking that. I tried to send it to your Instagram. But when something is 60 minutes or an hour over, you cannot send it. But she did say that people was confronting her ass about being drunk on there. And they said, you drinking that Crown and Hennessy. She said, no, I don't drink that heavily. I don't drink that heavily. And then they proceeded to say about bitches that's blocked. The bitches that's blocked on her page. And then it, then that's when Toya said, oh, that's the ones with the stank coochie. Oh. And... She was like, you know what? I just don't have time for negative things. And if the coochie smells, it smells. But she said, we in my practice, we deal with good and bad coochie. You can come over here. Oh. Was well, that what was said? That what was said. Damn, I, 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 I'm the only person that's been blocked. Because my shit is good. Well, I'm going to screen record and send it to you, Dr. Heavily, so you can see and it for you yourself. Y'all you think this show is ghetto today? And tell me the truth. Is it ghetto today? Because we yeah. just Because it was. It was. We thought you need a variety, right? It was ghetto today. It was. We need a variety or should we stop? I mean, you already <laughs> in the water. You might well <laughs> swim, girl, to the shore. Okay, well, sheesh. Okay, well, y'all want to talk about something else? Yeah, let's talk about something else, but I am no liar. I just wanted to get that straight. Coco says she ain't no liar. She got the receipt. She sent to try to send it to me, but it's over an hour. 
<laughs> Somebody you, screen record it. Somebody you screen can, record you can, it. You can go. You can go on Doctor Simone's page, and at the end, they have where they start talking and getting real messy. Oh well, that's all right. We gonna pray for them. Okay, I forgive. I forgive. Okay. You forgive, but you heard what Miss Jones said. Me, I'm gonna repeat. I'm gonna keep repeating this to you. Miss Jones said, if you go over there and fuck. With Toya again, she not watching the show no more. Damn. Damn, Toya. I like Toya. Damn. I, Toya just don't like me, and I'm sorry. I, I, I just can't make you feel like me. Yeah, but I'm sorry, Dr. Heaven. I had to be the bearer of bad news. That That's okay. <laughs> and the, bitch, the bitch did say it. The bitch did say, and people don't want you to be honest on here. She did say, go to Dr. Simone's page. You can go to her, her live. And at the end, her and Cecil get real messy. They real messed up at this point. They Somebody say, so they didn't say that. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, anyway, we're going to pray about it. We're going to pray about it. We're going to leave it alone. All right. Yeah, we promoted her book and everything. So T.S. Madison, what I supposed to do? If you was in my position, what would you do? Would you ignore the shit? Well, I mean, you know what you I mean, I love everybody, and I love the Lord. And honestly, I think that we're so blessed, T.S., to even have entertained this bullshit. But you know, I had to think about it. Yeah, because it, you, I mean, that wasn't even the direction you was going to go this morning. We were just going to talk because you asked me, have I got my nails done? We was going to talk about that. But you, I mean, it was something that happened last night. You had, you addressed I it. I woke up to it. They text me about it this morning. So I ain't know, you know what I'm saying? But I got I mean, it from a reliable source, though. I did. I mean, no shade. We, we, we want to see good TV. We want to see good TV. Right. We, we want to see it. So there's going to be things that you got to address. You feel me? And you ain't scared. You ain't scared to get in the ring with them. I, I mean. Fight no bitches. Like that girl in LA, I felt like she was ready to fight. Now, I ain't finna do that. Now, I ain't finna do that. You know what I'm saying? If I got my ass with Contessa way over there. I just, <laughs> <laughs> was coming though. Quad was, it's, Quad was late. But she was coming. She was like, oh shit, let me get my mic. Let me get my mic. What the hell going on? Yeah. But, I was being messy, so the girl got with me. We was good. I don't think she read me. I think she was finna whoop my ass, though, real tea. But uh, I don't know what they're gonna show. They might not show what I said. They might not show what she said. So I ain't no telling what they show. Well, okay. Well, so but one thing for damn show. One thing's for damn show. Jocelyn Hernandez read the shit out of Toya and ran her ass off her own fucking show. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> ass. That would be the ass. That's what I'm talking about. Now, now, now let me tell you, Jocelyn to fight her though. That's what I'm saying. Jocelyn, they girl, I felt like they girl was gonna fight me too, and there was no winning. Yeah, J Jocelyn, Jocelyn support her husband. Jocelyn was in her man's face. Yeah, Jocelyn to fight her. They did right. They went on home, right? Yeah. So you know, for me, I think it makes a good show. We want to see good show. We want to see. We like. That's what we watch the TV show for. For all of that. Well. No. This is Entertainment April. That's all it is. As long, long, as it, long as it don't get violent. We don't want right. no hands. Like, no, I don't want to watch. Can I say this and be honest? Yeah. The same thing that got me to watch and love and hip hop is the same thing that got me to stop watching it. That's what you get. Because mm -hmm. it's just I like it, it, I'm tired. Of, I, I'm it's just like they won't stop fighting. Like, girl, you 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 building up for the scene, like for the work, and then have they fight the fight the fight. The next, the next three minutes down the line, the fight, the fight, the fight, the fight, the fight. You don't even know what they thought about, right? It's just the fight, the fight, the fight. I'm okay with a good little shade, a good little drama, a good little, but it's just like the fight, 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 the fight. Up and down, arguing and carrying on here and there is okay. You get what I'm saying? But it's just the fight, the fight, the fight, the fight, the fight, the fight. I'm like, damn. I don't want to see no more, no more. Hair pulling no I more. No fight though. I, I I really think I think they fought before and it was so shocking and they fought so bad and it was so embarrassing that I, I I hope I'm hoping that would never happen again. You know what I'm saying? I'm hoping. Yeah. Now a good now, now this little shade something like this like this this little shade like we grown even though we grown we still do little shady stuff. So this little shade right here and you know you know get into a little conflict. I'm like ooh what she gonna say? I don't want to see nobody hit get decked in the eye no more. 
But you got to think, though, T.S. Madison, some of these people don't got shit else going on and nothing else to lose. That's why I pick and choose who I argue with. You know what I'm saying? I don't really want none of Toy Toy. ain't got shit to lose. She See, probably would hit somebody. She ain't got shit. <laughs> In fact, I want to say she said that her husband said it would be okay to fight. But his chick, don't quote me, but I think that was said. He said it was okay if she fought. So, but I don't think the people want to see that. Our, our advertisers don't want to see it. They just want to do a tongue rustle or whatever tongue, you know what I mean? And none of that. And I think it's getting too dirty. I, I don't want it to go to a point where it's not funny and it's not fun anymore. You know what I'm saying? Right, right. You need, get over it, move on. But my whole thing is when they talk about me, I can quickly read it. But then they ask to stay on it forever. Like they be mad forever. By the read that they came at me first. Right. So tomorrow you ain't gonna even you ain't gonna you ain't gonna even gonna be on this. I might. <laughs> here, you go, here you go. There no, no, you no. Go. Tomorrow we got mentally short from uh, Love and Marriage Huntsville. So she got so much shit to talk about. We ain't really. Okay. So what we initially wanted to talk about this morning, Dr. Heavenly, before we got into all of the things. Right. Sorry. We was talking about how you, you sent me that picture of the nails because your governor, it ain't my governor, but your governor opened back up the shops and all those people was out there in the nail shop you know, and it was just a mess. Now, I, obviously, both our hands look a mess. You know, I already got strong ass hands anyway, so you know, my hands need need some fingernails on them. My shit look fucked up. I'm ashy and all kind of stuff. So, are you not going out at all, heavily? No, I'm not. And you know, I re I thought about it before I did a challenge, and I thought about hairdressing challenge. But who has hairdressers? Who has hair salons? Who have nail salons? I, I didn't want to mess with my sisters. So I thought nails would be better than hair. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. To go and say, hey, you know what? Stay home. Nails ain't really a necessity. And on my page, we're showing the press on nails. So you don't even really have to expose yourself. So are you going, what are you, what are you actually going out for? At, you know, are you going out just for essential things like grocery store and then come back to the house? I have so somebody bring me my groceries. So when he brings them, I take them out the bag and we wipe them down. My daughter wipes them down. You know what I'm saying? So we don't go at all. Okay. So you ain't you haven't you don't go out anywhere at all. Pretty much no. I went I went for a drive the other day just to drive because I was sick of being home. You know how you get uh cabin fever. So I've been outside around my house, you know what I'm saying, in the backyard and stuff like that. But no, I haven't been anywhere in 37 days. Okay, so how long do you anticipate that this is going to be carried on? I don't know. I know I can't stay home forever because, you know, as a dentist, you know what I mean? People need services. There are people in pain. There are people that need stuff. So I'm trying to assess it to the point where it can be safe for me, my staff, and my patients. So I'm looking at uh, something Dr. Britton told me to get a, a papper where, where I can actually cover my head uh, with a, a, a respirator so I can breathe while I look at the patients. I definitely have the... Um, the uh, clear uh, film in front of the front desk so they can't really sneeze or call for me. And we always have been doing universal precautions with eyewear, masks. We have the N95 mask gloves. And then we have the uh, air purifier, you know, they use in the hospital to circulate the air to remove the virus from the air. So we're trying everything. But before we get out there, we got to see that it's going down a little bit. Okay. Because I do think that the cases. I think that the case is going to increase because they because the people just running out there doing whatever they doing without nothing you you know without no care in the month in the motherfucking world you know what I'm saying but for me I just wanted to know as you as the, as a dentist and as your practice is still going on like have you have you felt the impact in your finances with this oh, absolutely I don't have an income. I don't have an income at all, at all. I've been paying my staff. You know what I'm saying? I've been paying my staff because I think that's the right thing to do. You know what I'm saying? You know? So I don't have an income at all right now. Really? Girl, you look at that. <laughs> I thank God every day I do not have an income right now. I'm Toya right now. <laughs> I don't have an income. Wait, you wait. Why are you laughing? You just had to take a jab like that, Doctor Harris. Do it again. so you can understand. Do it again. Do it again. Who you is right now, girl? I'm Toya right now. <laughs> I don't have no income. I'm totally dependent on my man's income right now. Oh, I do know 
my coochie don't stink. That's what I do. <laughs> <laughs> I got some soap on it. I bet you that. <clears throat> This is why Toya don't like me. Nah, fuck. What did the lady tell me about Toya? The girl said this is why Toya don't like me. No, that ain't why. That ain't why. What did the lady tell me about Toya? What did the lady tell me about Toya? Joan said, if you fuck with Toya after this, Miss Joan said, if you fuck with her after this, she not watching the show no more. She said that woman, that woman wants your husband. She wants your life. Now, I didn't say this. I watched it with my eyes. That woman said that. She said that that she wants your life, but according to you currently right now, you live in hers. I'm living her life right now. I'm not by choice, not by choice, but I am living her life. <laughs> yeah, I'm jobless too, girl. I mean, uh, sterile. <laughs> Why is that funny, T.S.? You laughing at somebody's that? Come on, T.S., don't look at me like that. Don't laugh at me. No, I know. I'm just playing, Carissa. I'm saying my coochie don't stink. If they brought up coochies, I'm saying that man don't. I'm not saying that she said it. I'm not saying that she said it. I said I'm being toy right now, but I, I didn't say she said my coochie stink. I just said my don't stink. That's all I said. I didn't say she said it did. So there we go. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so that's it so I'm going to stay home with my name <laughs> now you know what the messed up part with this is T Madison this is the messed up part if they lied probably wasn't even that messy they just threw a few little jabs in the shit but we done took it to a whole freaking new level that guy, they finna get messy. Y'all is wrong. Y'all wrong and y'all took me there. My boopies. Uh. <laughs> I show ignorant today, Lakeisha. We gonna talk about how we come out of this the next day. <laughs> oh my God. Oh dear God, help me. That's why I'm on YouTube, bitch. <laughs> Girl, I done made four thousand dollars on your funky ass, okay? I will find a way to make a dollar. At least I can pay my light bill and phone bill and make me gas and water. <sighs> and I made four grand on YouTube fucking with y'all. And then Mary Reese keeps sending me money. She keeps sending me money in the super chat. Like, oh my God. Thank you. God is good. That's what I'm saying. Like, God take care of you, don't he? Oh my God, Jesus Christ! Don't do that. They should have never. That's somebody said they should have never. Paid y'all too much money for any of y'all coochies to be stinking. Oh dear God! Who said somebody coochie stink? Now I didn't bring the shit up. Now I don't know. Oh my God, dear God! I made some money. Listen, a person like me that's a businesswoman to find a way to make money. <sighs> well, we got to get Toya get a YouTube. We Toya got a YouTube channel down there. <laughs> she need one. I gave her all of her number. I swear to God, I gave her all of her number so she could start her own channel. I'm trying to help her. I swear, I, T.S., I'm serious. I gave her all of her number to go on and set up her damn YouTube. That's the kind of person I am. And then she gonna go in there and talk about me? Bitch, I tried to help you. I, I promise you, no, T.S., I'm telling the truth. I gave her Oliver's number to help her with her YouTube. So she gonna bring in the income. But I did, well... We gonna pray for her. She said the shit ain't that funny. Okay, that's too much for job. Exactly, such pretty miss. We ain't got no. Listen, they go. Uh, Oliver, what Oliver said? Uh, I lost them. Here we go. Oh dear. So, oh, my God. Okay, she don't need no job if, if if a man don't. I mean, you know, I just like working. But my whole thing is, I am blessed. Daddy has been able to go to work every day because he is an essential employee. Oh, yeah. The worker, I mean to say, you know what I'm saying? He has addiction. So we've been blessed, but I've been home, TS, and I don't have no income. And I don't like it though. I don't like it. I like to go to work. I really do. Who is going to watch a snake? I don't know. 
Dr. Heavenly, you know, you have. That's true, Spacey B. You can't go to work if you're dead, but we can't stay home forever. Like this, like, I think this, like, like Dr. Thing said, this is the new normal. At some point, we're going to have to go back out. Right, T.S.? Yeah, yeah, we are. We yeah. are. But we are, girl. But you have. See, you, 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 you done been so, so you done been so shady. Yes, you. You have been so shady in this past little few. You started off, you was, you came in in the tank mode. I moved on and tried to talk about nails and stuff and then asked you about your deal. You said you went right back into it. You, you I'm just saying, y'all know I ain't got no income. What? I don't have no income right now. I got to start meeting my man in the garage. I mean, I will. I'm going to make his bath water. It's my pleasure and honor to serve my man. I'm never going to be disrespectful. He is my king. Who, to, who taught you how to be like this, Dr. Heavenly? What queen? You don't be, you was around some queens when you grow up. Who taught you how to be like this? Mm -hmm. Which which gay? You know two, three gays when you was growing up. I ain't mean, I mean really no gays till I got on Bravo, for real. So you that this is so is this just some is this just in, is this in our Miami blood and our Florida blood? I think so I think that you know as a child we used to we used to join and it was all in fun and that's what I thought this was on the show but they I, I think they mad for real though but I promise you I'm not mad at anybody but I really can't mess with Toya next season why can't I mess with Toya Tears? Because Jones said. It, uh, it, listen, because I know they're going to try to mend relationship, because that's what TV do. You have conflict, then you mend. You know what I'm saying? And they're going to try to mend, y'all. They're going to set it up with y'all mend. And you may fall into the mending thing, because that's what you do on TV. But you're going to fall out again, because Jones said, wait, my titty, what's wrong with my titty? <laughs> I don't know. I didn't see nothing. Because Jones said, if you fuck with Toya, she ain't watching that motherfucker show no more. So this means that your fans said that you must be <laughs> rivals with Toya through the entirety of the show. That's gonna be that's your rival. So you about to get your reads together. Toya, Toya ain't even gonna be my rival. I'm not fucking with her. No, not on that level. I get to Simone though. I think Simone got some shit to lose, honestly. Oh, you going for who got something to lose? I mean, yeah, because it don't make sense, right? Why would I go for a bitch that ain't got nothing to lose? Like, you could say anything about her, it ain't gonna hurt her, her career. Oh, so I mean, oh my God. Do so you do you respect Toya's job? What's her job? <laughs> Tell me what it is. I mean, I know she wrote a book and it took her two years and it was 18 pages. But <laughs> That, that really it was that a job? Let me hush. Let me stop. I'm gonna stop. Y'all gonna stop it. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. So what did Jones say to us? John Jones. Jones. <laughs> Live too, but the difference in my life and they live is I'm actually getting a coin because Mary Reese done sent me some money, bitch. <laughs> Cheryl Lee said, Hold on, Cheryl Lee said, Hold on, I was looking at Cheryl Lee. Cheryl Lee said, Toya's job is she is a mother and she takes care, she has a master's degree and she's taking care of her husband. That's she her job. Her she don't take care of him and she ain't gonna take care of him so that's a lie okay she got a master's degree online that Eugene passed the test the kids go to school every day except for in the quarantine and I'm sure her sister is helping her with that y'all can't lie for her come on now I was trying to be nice so you can say that she got a master's yes her husband took the test online University of Phoenix wait Wait a minute. I told, my daughter, I told my daughter, I said, Alora, your classes are online right now. You ought to get straight freaking A's. All you got to do is ask Siri. 
You could be dumb, dumb, dumb. And I ain't calling nobody dumb, but you could get a degree online because all you do is ask serious shit. You taking a test? Dr. Heavily. Oh my God. Oh, stop it. Maddie, they came for me. I didn't say shit about them. Leave but, me alone. You go, y'all take it too damn far. But Heavily, you going for the juggler right now. You is okay. juggler. Yeah. Yeah. You should go for the juggler. They had little light shade to you. You were like, you going real. You go. very comfortable with her staying home and not doing nothing. So I, I'm not light shade. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. No, don't ask Alexa. Ask Siri. Siri, no. Alexa be playing. Alexa be acting like you, she don't hear your ass. If you say the wrong name, I say, uh, 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 Alex. She won't answer. I say, I know she hear me. She won't answer till you say Alexa. Gertie, as you looking at these comments, Dr. Heavily, what your, say? your fans is over there going, your fans is going, I ain't got nothing to say about that. I don't know nothing about that, that kingdom. I don't know nothing about that. I don't know nothing about that either. Mm -hmm. But Heavily, you is going in for the juggler. You are juggling her. Because <clears throat> it's just like... They shade was light. Now it was a little shady, but it was light. But you going heavy with the shade. I don't know who the fuck I am. I left them alone. They had done it before. Simone has said some shit like when it's when it's when it's when it's when it's uh smoke there's fire or some shit like that. They told me the people be telling me. I left alone. I said, you know what? I hope that me and Simone friendship can get on back on track. No, we can't. So fuck it. So it's heavy shade from now on out. I don't know no light shade. I told fucking that neither. I just gotta be quiet. So if y'all don't want me to address it, then I don't need to address it at all. Cause I don't have no light nothing. <laughs> I do everything good. I do everything rough. <laughs> That's how we do. I, I just want to know who took the master's test. Eugene took it. He's very smart. He's very intelligent. Eugene took the test. She'll tell you he took the. <sighs> Jane took it his. So it's her husband's degree? I mean, he put her name on it because he already had a doctorate's degree. So he took the master test at Phoenix University of Phoenix. He paid for it too. He bought it and he took the test. Let me stop. What did the lady say? What did, what did Jones say? Uh, Jones said, Jones said, <laughs> if you fuck with Toya, this season of Married to Medicine, she not watching the show no motherfucking mo. She not. Well, we wanted to watch. Oh, so that means you just not fucking with it. Okay. Mm, we good. We good. We good. We should have showed me who she was. I really tried y'all because y'all saw it on here. If you didn't see it back, look back at my lives. I ain't did nothing but compliment the girl. So next time when y'all come on Dr. Heavenly Live, okay, yeah, making shit up now. The girl ain't cheating, and I, I, cause I'm gonna eat. The next time y'all come on Dr. Heavenly Live, you got to say things like this: hashtag Jones said. Jones said so. Jones be here every day though. Jones be ready. She be here. Jones be here every day, but you got to understand it. The, the, the way Jones. That's right. Jones said. Jones said so. When anytime when 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 they come back on TV and you see Dr. Heavily and they have them out eating and going to the restaurant and you know what I'm saying, pulling up at the place and all, when 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 Andy them be running that shit across the screen, like tweeting right now, Jones Jones said, if you fuck with Toya this season. She ain't watching the show no motherfucking more. And she meant that. And you don't want to lose a fan, do you? Mm -mm. <laughs> important to me. Everyone is important to me. That's why I spend my time talking to y'all every day. Y'all my boopies. I love y'all for real. I do. Let's change the subject because I feel like, okay. I, don't I tried to, girl. Yeah. I tried to talk about oh, this. Oh, I tried to change the subject. I did. And, girl, you went right back there. You you, you brought the plane right back. I didn't so bring I, it, girl. I just yeah. said I was home without an income. Like Toya. You know, I mean, I wanted y'all to understand. 
how you know Toya ain't selling books? She wrote a book, so that's her book, so that's her income. I think she's selling flat tummy tea. But okay, let's go ahead on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm finna go eat that. Yeah, she says she sells sell flat tummy tea. That's her job. Okay, so anyway. Come on, these people not my true, true friend, Chandra. You didn't get that? These people don't give a fuck about me at all. At all, Chandra. I don't know why you don't get that. They don't care. But anyway, we're too deep in the water. Let's come back up for air. Girl, we, girl it, we done drown. We done drown. Oliver done... Oliver done text me and said, Maddie, why did you let Dr. Heavenly go way deeper than that? Oliver done text me. Yeah, I go too deep, y'all. Oliver, Oliver done text me about 50 times and say, Maddie, why you let do why you let her do that? They said, why you let her do that? And I'm like, girl, we y'all was doing too much. Y'all doing too much. Ooh. That's right. Said, look what Joan said. What did Joan say? Joan said, if you but with Toya, she not watching that TV show no more. And you, she mean that, Doctor Heavily. Uh, according to this session or not, I got to, I got to be digging into getting this. I got to dig into this. Okay, so let's go to something else. Okay, so we're staying at home, Maddie. Okay, what's gonna be the determining factor of us leaving our houses? Because I mean, at some point, we gotta leave, right? I mean, well, I think the determining the determining factor of us leaving leaving the house for me is when 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 they found some type of uh, treatment when they found some type of adequate treatment that's safe a safe treatment yeah Oliver is texting me now saying why 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 I, when I, when they find a treatment. Laughing. He got the laughing emoji. So Oliver is messy. Yeah, he is. And texting me talking about why. Yes, why? Why did you do that? I didn't do nothing. They had oh, can't for, the record, for the record, before we go to some, I ain't say shit about nobody husband. Did yeah. I? Look who this is. My God today. Who is that? Who is that? Oh, oh wait a minute. It's connected. Hold on. Now this ain't Oliver. Hey, y'all pull up the uh the uh the link for whoever that is so we can bring them in, whoever it is. Uh, no, no, we need to hold on, hold on. No link. It say connect and hold on. I gotta do this again. Oh, but at any rate, they say what's your channel, uh Maddie? Do you, know. do you know look at your friend that got me over here trapped up in all this stuff? I ain't doing nothing. Yeah. Listen, please click on that link, girl. Mm -hmm. I just woke up. You said no. He naked, y'all. Let him sleep. He naked. <laughs> girl. He naked. It, it, it done been World War 300 over here. No, it wasn't that bad, Funky. Just tell him what <laughs> Tell him what Joan said. Tell him what Joan said. Joan said. Tell, tell Funky that. Joan said that if Dr. Heavenly fought with Toya this season, she not watching the show no motherfucking more. Uh-uh, no, listen. Dr. Heavenly said she ain't going to disappoint Joan. <laughs> also, I all got to feel you friends, in. All my fans mean something to me. I got to feel you in. Okay, last night, you know, there was three lives went on. There was some slight shade throw that Dr. Heavily all last night. So when Dr. Heavily got up this morning, we were supposed to be talking about nails. Okay, I come, I walk right into the whirlwind of somebody coochie being stained. Oh God! Man. <laughs> Wait, and I found out that right now, currently. Dr. Heavily has Toya's income, <laughs> which is which, which according to Dr. Heavily, her income is zero right now. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I don't want no part. So, also, okay, 
Toya was uh basking in the ambiance that Kendra had read Dr. Heavenly. And Dr. Heavenly said, Well, bitch, it wasn't not no match for that reading that Jocelyn put on your ass and ran you off for of your own show. <laughs> I ain't had nothing to do with this, Dineva. Dineva, I'm just trying to pay my light bill. That's all I'm trying to do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have no income right now. We gonna pray. Somebody say, fucking Dineva is sleep through all the tornado weeks. <laughs> 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 We gonna pray. Listen, so okay, so your nails look pretty. You gonna do some press on? <laughs> this it. This it. Can I bring some more people in? Okay, I'm gonna bring this girl in. Okay, hey Mika, what's up? Mika. Hey, I'm I just trying to. We can't hey. hear you. Beautiful. We can't hear hey. you. Sorry. Come back Come in, me. baby. We can't hear her. Hey, Kia, my nails look pretty. We talking about nails now. <laughs> hey, Kia. Kim, Kim. Kia don't even want to talk about nails. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Listen, so we're going to move on. So the positivity in this is. Okay. Ain't no positivity in this. Ain't that. It, you might well go to finish your show out. Way. You, you can't even change it. You might well finish it out just like it is. And and start I'm going to leave it on a positive note. Um, the SBA loans have new new money. Uh, Trump did sign the release for $480 more billion to the small businesses. Okay? So if you did not get your stimulus check or your PPP, there's still a chance, but you need to go ahead and file for it right quick. They told me the quickest way to get your stimulus check, your PPP and your um and your uh, payroll protection check is to uh, through the SBA is to file through PayPal. Who knew? Somebody say PayPal does it a lot quicker than the banks do. So if you got a small business and you didn't get the first part of that, that money, that $2.2 trillion or whatever it was, they ran out of money like really quickly. Of course. Everybody said, it, ain't it ain't as much, but go ahead and file. And usually you should already be approved by your bank because the bank didn't get the money. They gave it to the big businesses. But they're saying now PayPal is the quickest way to get approved. That's what the people say. Now, I cannot say that for sure, but I got a few friends that said they filed through PayPal and they got approved immediately. Yeah, I mean, what is it? It's Synchrony Banks gives up all the money. <clears throat> Synchrony Bank, because I guess... You know this dude, Spilly Boy? I watch his videos sometimes. I love Spilly Boy. He be on my show, you know, my man in the morning. He calls on... the money about? Like, they gave it to me because I said I ain't had no income. And because you said that your income was like Toya. Heavenly, you said it now. Y'all wrong for that, okay? Listen, y'all messy. Okay, but you know what? It's okay to have a little mess. We all friends, and Toya, my friends, so we gonna go on and get on with our, our friendship, okay? Free and I. I love her. What did Joan say? Joan said, if you fuck with Toya, she ain't watching that motherfucking show no more. And she meant that. That's okay. right. If you fuck with Toya after this, she said that. Okay. Oh! Why is they hashtagging Jones said? You know everything. <laughs> Jones said. Hashtag Jones said. Jones said. If you fuck with Toya after this, let's see, uh, hey girl, what's up? We about to log off. It's been over two hours. So I'm messing with you, man. I know it has. Can I just say, look, y'all are killing me the hell out. Did you I am getting my life. Did you, did you scream and holler, girl? I screamed, I hollered, I fell on the floor. Uh, then I rolled, then I rolled over onto the ground. Like I just had to, I had to chime back in. Doctor Heavenly, you are a hot ass mess. I love the way you read, honey. I, I love the way you read. I told him. Hey, Maddie, they, they, I don't even know they, what they said on the live. I don't really they, even know what was said. I try to find it live. I can't even find it. I guess they they, they deleted it. I guess no, they got scared and deleted I'm, it. I'm gonna I'm screen record it and I'm gonna send it to Doctor Heavily. So Are you she, gonna put it on the docket tonight? Oh, 
Bring me in if you put it on the docket. I want to talk about it. We Are you gonna put it on the docket? Yes, please, Maddie. Put I'm, them. I'm, I'm, I'm put them. Put them on the docket, Maddie. I'm a screen record it. I'm a screen record it because tell I, Heavenly, tell Heavenly one more time what Jones said. Jones said if. <laughs> I'm gonna pay my light bill. I ain't even playing. She ain't fucking with you. No, no. Listen, heavily. I love you. Putting Thank you. Shirts on my damn. It's on my damn. Yes. Yes. Hashtag. Jones said. Right. Especially, especially <laughs> since your income. We're going to put hashtag Jones said. Jones yes. said. <laughs> if you fuck with this. Don't get your income up, Beverly. No. You do not want to be on. Get your income up. You said that the, 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 you and Toya. Y'all, y'all, y'all on the same income bracket. We, we, hey. going to sell them Jones said shirts. I know that's right. I bought one. I bought one from you. Man. I'm never gonna leave my man out there to pay everything. I, off I'm gonna I know that's right. I know that's right. So I'm gonna sell some Jones said t-shirts. Yeah, I'm gonna. <laughs> I bought one from you. I bought one from you. At least it'll get you out of toys. I don't have the Jones said t-shirts tonight. I ain't even playing. <laughs> ah! Hey, thank y'all so much for giving me my life. She is a she is a mad at Toya for real. I'm not mad at Toya. I'm just playing. Hey, darling. Hey, Jasmine. Hello, how are you? Hey, Jasmine. I just want to say, hey, Miss um, Madison. All I want to say is that you should take and bring TS on to uh, whenever you get ready to do this, so she can remind you of saying. Jones said, "Don't Jones fuck said. with." It. Yes, period. Jones said, <laughs> "Look, I'm at work. I had to stop at work just to say." John said, don't fuck with him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you do it, it's on you. Don't say it. Don't do it. And you know Let it lie about- forever. <laughs> In every color. For every you- episode, I'm aware. I'm a wear my t-shirt, <laughs> And you know Joan from the islands. And you know them island girls got their intuition from the spirits, honey. So Joan said. Period. Don't fuck don't with him. you? Boom, it's done. Don't, don't, don't. I didn't say That's, it. I didn't say it. Who said it, Maddie? Joan said. Don't say it. Wish you want her cut on the t-shirts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I just want to come through, and I just wanted to say that, and I appreciate everything y'all are doing, and I'm glad that y'all are doing this and interacting with us. Thank yeah. you. Have a blessed day. Thank, Thank you again. Like and subscribe and share with your friends. We just yeah. having fun. You know what I mean? I love everybody for real. We just having fun. But Joan said, "Don't fuck with them." That's right. I have to. <laughs> That's my new line. See you later. Bye, baby. All right, we got one more person, and then we gonna log off because I got to cook for my man. Hey, girl, it's can we hear you? Hey, I can't hear y'all again. I can hear you. What you want to say? I think it's my audio. I'll just say hi. Hey, I can hear you. What do you want to say? I can hear you. Yeah. Love y'all. I'll just type a message. Okay. All right. Beautiful. Thank you. She was right out of her shower. Yeah. Oh, my God, Dr. Hibble. I got my mama. You smell like cornbread out there. Thank you, Jackie P. Come home and eat. Yeah, come on. Have Heavenly on the Queen's Court. Jones said. Jones said. Listen, I may have to call you tonight. I may have to call Craig and see if we put it together. We start we started out with what Jones said. That's what we're gonna do. Well, now, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go ahead on because I think y'all did we did we have some positivity today? Because I like no, a no, we had no positivity, Dr. Heavenly. No, it was all reads, and it's okay because what, what people learn today, you are very swift, sharp, and deadly. Very swift. Somebody said when we start season eight. And Toya say something to me. I'm gonna say on camera on Mary the Madison. John said, <laughs> I "Fuck with you, okay? she gonna be John, because she gonna see this live. She gonna know who John is." She been on it. Somebody said she was on here. Oh, oh. So yeah, that's your ass Oh well, I ain't did nothing to nobody. It was John said. John said this stuff. It was John. It was, it was John. John now. It was I just watched. Joan sat me down. Listen, 
Heavenly Joan sat me down for the. She said it, the way she came on, she was passionate. T.S., sit down, girl. You don't even watch this motherfucker. Let me tell you, I was like, oh, I had to put my hand on her. Like, sit down, girl. If you fuck with Toya after this, I, don't, I ain't watching this show no motherfucking more. And she meant that. It was so much pass, passion in that. Somebody Joan, said she got better things to do. Like what, boo? Like what? It says Toya ain't on this show. She got better things to do. Like what? Please help me. Come back. I want to talk about what she got to do. <laughs> I'm going to say it on the show. I'm going to be like, listen, bitch. Joan said. Don't let me forget either P.S. Madison. Oh, I'm not. <laughs> listen, I, I'm, I'm not. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually I'll hit my, my T-shirt, my guy up that makes it. What You want a T-shirt that say Joan said? I do. I do. No. I pay for it. I want are it. You, yeah. do you, are you sure you want an image that say Joan said? Joan said it. She did. We ain't lying. She said it. And I'm going to put in the smile, if you fuck with Toya after this, I ain't watching the show no more. That's what she said. All right. Now, are you sure you want I'm it? Sure I'm here for the fans, girl. I'm here for the fans. That's why I'm here. But anyway, they say they all want one, so we got to sell it on the thing. Oliver, Joan said they said they going to buy the shirt. Joan be here every day, though. Joan be here every day. But it can't just say Jones said. It got to have in small print. Jones said, "If you well, I don't know what to put on it, he'll know what to do." If you fuck with Toya after this, I ain't watching that show no more. Oh, somebody that sent me the live. Y'all some messy people. Somebody that <laughs> sent it to me. I yeah, told they, you they about it, but they don't sent it to me now. Yeah, so let me my ducks in a row. All right, well, go on and watch it, child. Let me call my friend and see that he will he make that thing for you. Okay, I see you later. Listen, we're gonna have to end in some positive. What positivity you want to put out there, T.S. Madison? And what you got going on? Your books, your whatever. I ain't got nothing going on. I'm sitting in the house just like everybody else. But I got, I got, I got my old income. I, I got my income. Oh, you got some. You ain't like, <laughs> you ain't like us. You ain't like me and Toy. You not. Oh, oh no, I want to be like you. I want your type of income. You I don't know. That not not right now. I don't know Toy's income. I don't know that. Come out right now. We ain't got nothing. You don't want this. Okay, so let me ask you this before we leave. So when we go when we go back to working, and you go back to your income, right? Is Toya income gonna be? Is gonna increase? She gonna have income when I get back to working, and you have income, and you know, is she gonna have income? I mean, when the show start, but I mean, the show called Married to Medicine. So without a husband, she can't really have that income. <laughs> Why are you messy? I don't even like this shit no more. Uh-uh, we got to go back to prison. I'm just answer the question because I don't know how the income works. Okay. <laughs> let's, <laughs> hey, let's, let's continue this on Queen's Court because people want to hear about it. We're going to be real messy, okay? Let me, call, let me call Craig and see if we do it one tonight. I'll, I'll get let's you together. We can do it another night. Hell, yeah, listen, you shit. I ain't got nothing to do. Next <laughs> the out of mind is the devil's workshop. We need to sit on that. I need to stop. I need to go back to work. That's what need to have. They need to open this thing back up. But they already did. But I need something to make me go back to work because this is not this not good. It's not good. This is not good. We need to stop it. Mm. Stop okay. it. Okay? Don't say it, though. Yes. Yeah, she did. And I'm going to remember. I'm going to remember. <laughs> All right, Maddie, let me know when you're doing your court, because I just, I don't need the whole thing. Just a little docket. I want to be on the docket. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right? All right. I love you, you darling. I appreciate you guys. You my girl. I call, I love you. I love you too, darling. I love you so much. See you next time. Okay. I'm gonna okay, call you later. Okay. Okay. Bye. All right, beautiful. Bye bye. Hey guys, listen. We had a lot of fun. Hopefully, we didn't go too deep, but I have a chance. I always do that. But leave me alone. That's how I feel about it. But um, anyway. This week, we got an amazing week for you guys. I'm, I'm really trying to entertain y'all, keep y'all going, keep y'all laughing, keep you maybe too messy. I don't know, but y'all like it sometimes. But tomorrow, we have um, Melody S. Holt here. I don't know how many how many y'all watch um, Love and Marriage Huntsville? Let me know. Hey, like the video. How many y'all watch Love and Marriage Huntsville? 
Well, Melody Show S. S. Holt. I said her name wrong. It's Melody S. Holt. We'll be here tomorrow. We're going to talk about everything about love and marriage, Huntsville. And uh, we're going to dig deep. But, you know, um, she seems to be more sensitive. So I'm going to be real easy with her. You know what I'm saying? Y'all be real nice to her, too. We'll let her share as much or as little as she wants to um, because she's a really nice lady. Um, And I really don't. I really don't know they T. I know what they said, but I really don't know they T. So we're gonna talk about it. We're gonna get there. We're gonna talk about it and um see what's going on with her. Wednesday, we have Shanique Drummond from Married to Medicine LA. She's gonna be on the girl that they say look like my daughter. I really don't see it, but you know, but she's a nice lady. I really, really like her husband. Um, and he's a hard worker. Um, and then Thursday we have Shay Johnson. Love her. Um, I don't know her as well. She's on Love and Hip Hop. Um, and maybe we'll have some people chime in with her that know her. We'll see that. That's going to be really good. And then Friday, we have um, Jasmine. I love her too. Jasmine Johnson from uh, Maritime Medicine LA. Um, she's the beautiful one with the big house and you know the cars and everything. She's really LA, if you will. So y'all don't leave me. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate you guys. Thank y'all so much for everything y'all done. Um, and um, we're gonna keep going. Um, um, we're gonna keep going, so we don't know. Okay, so y'all have a good day, and I see y'all next time. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye.